What is the crack and welcome back to another video in this video I'm gonna be making my new game Operation Deadshot. It's not a Proper name at the moment. This is what I have it as for the time being Um, It is going to be like a multiplayer survival game But you have to survive the other players that are in the game with you It's gonna be like up to you who goes together like what teams are which at the time being until I add like a, a multi kind of like a team system but it's just going to be whoever's in the game like two or three can go that way and then two or three go the other way and then in like 10 minutes a siren goes off and then he's just kill each other and whoever wins wins so how you doing dark shadow how you doing shiny how you doing torn and how you doing neve we have five or six people in the stream already so i might as well just play it here and show you what i have so far um, there is an earlier version of this you guys can go and download right now the, uh, it's in the description I wouldn't recommend doing it because straight after this video. I'm gonna be putting up this version So this is what I have so far. I uh, don't mind the um, uh, What's it called the level and the experience and all that isn't 100% fixed So I'm just making aware I can actually see the comments and the game. So there we go. Okay. Hey doing flimsy What is the crack? So right now we have this little island I've made with some stone like stone material some grass some sand over here I'm gonna make it that when you go into the water you actually uh, like start to need um you need like oxygen so you can't permanently stay under there as you can see the water has a little bit of waves to it if you go under the water this isn't 100% to the height of it yet but when you go under the water see look it's a little bit off I need to fix when you go under the water it's all blurry and you can't really see. Ayo hey, Flan can't stay here long. I'm watching a live stream which is going to show a new Splatoon 2 trailer. Okay, no better. It's it's so warm in Ireland right now. Also, there's a little mini map at the top you guys can hopefully see. And I've added in trees. The trees aren't the most realistic trees. Again, everything is just kind of like a, a template version. I'm going to Texas tomorrow. Nice. So this is just kind of like a template tree and a template rock for the time being until I get around to making better ones. But it, it's, it does the it does the job. So if you run over and attack it with your weapon, it drops wood. You then go over to it. Obviously, I know I'm going to make the wood a little bit smaller. Again, template. You go over, break it up. Boom. Pick up the items. That wood went flying. Don't go into the water. Ah, it's gone. You're not getting that one back. Uh, so then you go over here and you can craft your your normal your normal stuff. Um, because of like being different varied heights in mountains, getting everything to work like snapping isn't really one hundred percent working like it used to. So things are gonna either float a little bit or they're gonna stick into the ground a little bit. So this is the underground base. So now you click it, you go back under your under your base as always. And then you press E and you're back out. Everything works there. Uh, the floor, where's that? Here we go. See, the floor sticks out a good bit now. The floor used to be perfectly on the ground. But to fix that, I just kind of added like a, a little like a little base around it. So it kind of looks like um, kind of looks like it sticks out a little bit of the ground. So it's kind of like a foundation type thing. Um, I, I know... Six degrees in Houston. I don't know, maybe deep sea fishing. I can't possibly see him. It's raining all week where I am. Oh no, same here, sketches. I'm loving it. That's why it has me in streams. Because I've just been keeping falling asleep, to be 100% honest with you. Hey, doing, Anthony. And uh, thank you very much, Dirk. So, also, there's another thing I've added. Now, it used to be when you had this on it and you pressed E, it would level up. I've changed that to this. Because this one you can, like, have complete manipulation over so you press e on it and it changes i haven't fixed it where it changes the foundation of it yet but you can do you can now upgrade everything i also have alcohol here alcohol here beside me that i haven't uh drank yet but you can if you go to the wall and then if you do this let's craft the wall rotate it okay so you can also use your mini map at the top of your screen to actually see where you're placing everything so you don't have to randomly guess so like See there, I was a little bit off. You can uh, you can delete this. Uh, there we go. Okay, 
So, let me click again. So, about here. Yeah, see? Went into the ground. That's what I wanted. Oh, now I need to fix the thickness of the wall just a little bit. How are you, Flan? I'm doing pretty good. Sorry, I'm kind of just trying to read comments. My uh, There's a lot of wires in front of my shit. Uh, deep sea diving sounds cool. Jordan would love the Holocaust Museum. Fuck's sake, Neve. Uh, uh, don't hurt the poor sharks. Uh, is this going to be an MMO? It's going to be um, kind of like a multiplayer survival game, if it makes sense. Like you're, uh, One or two people are going to spawn over here. And then other people are going to spawn over here. I literally just made this bridge. Like I'm run uh, like This is walking speed. And then this is sprinting speed. Like, I'm, I'm going to have to increase the speed because this island is freaking huge. Look at this. This is how big I've made the island. So, in case we do get, like, in case we do make it where a lot of people are going to be playing it. That's, that's where my house is right there. That little small area compared to all of this. And I could still later on in the future add on more islands to it, so. Um, <laughs> just Damn. Also, if you guys enjoy this, please give it a thumbs up. As I was saying, there will be a uh, a version, a updated version of this later on uh, in the link that's in the description. So I just added this bridge just before starting the stream, so now people can actually get to the other side. You could just go through the water, but as you will see here, I haven't implemented swimming, so you're just kind of stuck at the bottom. And I think the sand actually turned out pretty good. So. In this video, I'm going to, I have a, like, I have a shitload of stuff. Like, I've actually planned out what I want. Like, I can, I have a gun in it as well, actually, but I'm going to remove the gun and add in a bow and arrow. Uh, I'm going to add in some rain, mist, weapon. These are all the things I want to add. I won't add them all in this video, but see you later, uh, sketches. Have fun. Uh, these are the things I'm going to add. So... A, a bow and arrow, rain, mist, weapons, rain, glare, so when the rain hits you, you kind of see it go down your face, <laughs> uh, god rays, solar flares, uh, more materials, so things look better, underwater physics, a food system, hunger system, health system, rocks, containers, better animations, make sure the images don't clip when you accidentally put like a, a wall on top of a wall, uh, fall damage, a timer, so... Uh, once two or three people spawn, a time will be like a timer will start going down, and once the timer goes down, then you fight. So you have like four or five minutes to build a base or to upgrade your character. Um, I've already added a skybox animals, so you can get food or tame them and they fight with you. Abandoned buildings, so there'll be already broken out little houses that you can get, maybe from previous players. Wherever people build an old house, I'll leave it there, and whatever loot is in it, people can just get it and then like, uh, kind of progress through that. Tree stumps. So when you cut down your when you cut down a tree, just a stump is left. Uh, fish in the water. Birds. Single player mode, so you can kind of play it by yourself and learn the basics, like I was there. And uh, make images for when I go into the inventory. You can actually see what things are instead of it just saying wall. Um. Okay. Uh, we're going to. Okay. So the first thing I'm gonna add is probably rain, because that's probably the easiest. Okay. So sorry if this is a little bit laggy because I'm trying my best to do a lot of shit. Like I'm recording, I'm streaming me making the game, I'm making the game. So, and this isn't like my phone game. This is, as you guys saw, a lot bigger of a project. Also, if you guys do get this game, when you're going to play it, don't go into... Uh, LAN, that, that's only if you have two, If that's like, if someone is beside you playing, playing it with you, you need to go to enable matchmaking, and then you can either create a game, so you can go, uh, flan, you can create whatever, you, you can call it whatever you want, create a game, don't press any of the other settings, then boom, I've created a game, you ready up, and then you wait for another player to join in, it would actually be pretty cool if someone did join in there, <laughs> no one has the game, um, so, also, if you do want to play it by yourself, go in here and just go add player and then uh, press ready on boat. 
Okay, so um, I just want to say it's awesome you're creating a game. Can't wait to play it. Uh, I'm not that type of... Uh, I'm into that type of stuff, creating games and such. I've wanted to do it. You should. It's really good. Um, I have a, an older game, um, Dirk. If you, wanna, if you have an Android phone, you can go and get it. Uh, Survival Spirits. If you click the link in the description, it'll bring you to my... Um, uh, what's it called? Game Jolt page, and you should be able to get it from there. So I'm gonna add a another object to my player. So where the fuck is he now? Uh, player, 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 player. I'm also gonna add like a, a first person to third person uh, camera swap. Uh, okay, so create an empty. Put the empty just above the character a little bit. I'll call this a uh, rainmaker probably. Would be the easiest way around it. Uh, rain maker. Mm. Um, let's crack James. Um, I'm making a shitty one. So Weber and is okay. I can't read any of this. No, this is a crazy bus driver and I wanted to crush it. Wait, hell, what the fuck? Um, okay. So particle system. If my computer would work with me here, there we go. Particle system. I want this to go down the way. Oh, okay. You can actually see that the god rays are kind of working right now. It wasn't working in the game, but it's working here. I don't know why. You can actually see kind of like the oh, coming off them. Um, oh my god, my laptop is broken. Okay, so I want it to. I don't hate James in a game though. Hate I'm James. As you do. <laughs> So I want this to go like full force down like that. Okay, I also want them to die a lot faster. So one second. It's a lot, long, lot longer than one second. Um, life, one second. Um, hey, don't worry. Um, would you? Would you like to talk later in a party or something and we could come up with ideas to help? You know, maybe you could teach me about that stuff. If you want, you can go on Facebook or Twitter. That's probably the easiest way to do it. Or message me on this video once it goes up on YouTube. I don't, I don't, uh, what's it called? Use my PlayStation or Xbox to like go on parties. And also my PlayStation Plus is still gone and my Xbox is actually about to go in like three days. So I need like a hundred euro to top bow it and then back up. Okay. Okay, so I need to make a rain texture, I guess. I haven't made one of these yet, so Okay. Um Start speed, start lifetime. I need it to, to die after a few seconds. See, yeah, it's only lasting like a second or two. Okay, there we go, that should work. Okay. So now let me add here material and I want this to be stretched to make it like she look like rain there you go and now just make a little crappy rain texture so I'm just gonna do a little a little dot or a kind of like a, a bubble effect thing On. See, as you can see, my computer is completely frozen. So I'm trying to open up like, oh, there we go. I'm trying to open up like 20 projects at once. So the rain isn't going to be too big. So we don't need to put the most detail into the image. So it can be a fairly small image. So, also, thank you very much for the thumbs ups and the dislikes. So, let me just do. I could just do like this. That would, that would pretty much be it. But I just give it like a little crappy 
blue see-through tint, I guess. So new layer, boom. And remove this. And then turn on the opacity. So that would pretty much do as a... Um, uh, that would pretty much do as a, a rain texture because you're not going to be seeing it for much. You're not going to be seeing it for much. You're not going to be seeing it for long. Thank you very much for your two thumbs ups. We reached 10 already. Thank you guys very much for that. Um, so I'm just going to call this rain uh, temp because it will probably be changed in the future. So because I put temp beside it, I know to remove it in the future. So, operation deadshot, assets, and okay. If you want. Hey, doing a open toast? What is it, crack, buddy? No, that's because he was here ages ago and he's done a lot of shit. Like, just don't don't ban. Just uh, time in. Okay. Hey, doing welcome toast. Mm -hmm. I feel better now. <laughs> I don't know what he said, but I feel better now. The second he joined in, I got three dislikes. So, oh. and he was, I don't know. Hey, doing Connor? What's the crack, man? I know, I can see. Okay. So, um, Rainmaker. Um, where's that rain temp? Here we go. So, I want to get rid of the the black behind it, because obviously you don't want to see the black. <clears throat> and you want to be able to see true the, uh, true the texture. So, also, this isn't a material at the moment. So, I need to go cube. Then I need to drag on rain temp onto that, so it makes it. What's happening? And uh, not much. Just making a game at the moment. Okay, so this is what the texture looks like apparently. So as you can see, it just makes it a slight blue. So, okay, and then I go up here, rainmaker. I need to find that uh, material that was just there. So, material, materials, no, um, up here, materials, rainmaker, rain, temp, right, okay, here we go, rain temp. So, now let me drag this in. So, kind of looks okay. I just want to go into this, make this a, um, unlit, uh, transparent. And now click this again kind of looks like rain it's a very very bad um rain but um it's rain so we'll just uh save that again like all this i'm just putting it in just so i can have it for the time being and then later on down the line i'll like i'll upgrade it and make it better so i'm just adding in very like simplistic versions of them like the uh, the weapons I have in my hand are just cubes and a circle like I have an axe and all but I just haven't got around to adding them in yet so okay so now we'll actually see if that looks decent in the game so um, it's not the best so I'm gonna go and try add it and make it a little bit better or add to it so rainmaker okay so let me go render sketched horizontal no uh, vertical there we go that's a bit better um i wanted to go in a shape of a box i want this to go straight down and i want the box to be a little bit wider a little bit, nope, not that one. A little bit more this way. There we go. That works good. 
Now I want to go into a mission. So the most you can have is 10. Let me make that 100. That looks like rain. That looks like pretty good rain to me. So now you just go save. And delete. I have to always delete the player because if I don't, then I end up losing my inventory, which is a bitch. So this is what it looks like in the game. Like as you see, it just kind of like disappears once it hits the ground. But it, it's working. As I was saying, as I was saying, I just did a little box as a, a temporary. Later on in the future, I'll end up making a better texture than just a circle. I can, in the future, make it where when we go to the water, you can actually see that the droplets hit it and collide with it. And also, you don't want this, when you're under the water, to still be able to see the rain. So that's going to be a problem I'm going to have to fix as well. Okay. But for now, we will just add in um, health. Health script. So... Let me just drink some more. If you guys have anything you want me to add, let me know. Okay. So, player. Um, canvas. So, for the time being, I don't want to have... Any of the... I don't want to have the timer or anything on it. Um bullets bullet normal bullets I could, I'll turn them off just for the time being um health and this I'll keep but I want to make a white so just I can see them a bit better and you guys can see them a bit better see you later Anthony sorry that these videos aren't the most enjoyable I will be doing a a proper game soon hopefully tomorrow Okay, so here we go, health. So I'm going to make a, a C sharp script and just make it a player's health. H. H. Fucking H. E. A. L. T. Yeah. Just looked wrong for some reason, health did. Excuse me. Come on. Add a picture of me as a texture of rain. <laughs> Fuck's sake, boy. Uh, do you want to make say? Wait, what? I don't want to make. Cancel. The fuck. Okay, let me just apply the changes to the uh, to the player. Can you do GTA? I will. I will be buying my PlayStation Plus probably tonight or tomorrow. So yeah, I'll I'll probably do G do GTA tomorrow if I can. Okay, so this is going to open up mono develop. Again, thank you guys very much for the thumbs ups. It's a keyboard keeps going. Hmm. I have f five, four, six of quarters. Nice. I thought you were going to Texas tomorrow, man. Hey, are you going to play GTA? So, okay, let me just get rid of this. Uh, on start, health equals. No, okay, let me just do a public. Public. Uh, int. Players. I'll just call it health. Health. There we go. So now here we just go health is equals to 100 there we go and update if health is less than zero wait less than or equals to zero um destroy uh, game object so pretty much kill me if I'm less than this. Um, fuck, I forgot. 
Hey, doing, Evan? What's the crack, man? Okay. So now I also want to add in a uh, on collision. So I have one or two on collisions here. I'm just not bothered rewriting that out. So I'm pretty sure I have it. Here we go. So and here. Actually, no. Wait, wait. wait. It should be in spawned material. So if I get because. You want the player is going to be shooting the same attack from his uh, axe that does damage to the trees than it does to the player. Okay, so this is just going to be changed to void. Uh, collider is in front. And then call is here. There we go. Uh, tree does not exist in this script. Uh, neither does this. None of these do. And health is with a capital H in this script. Okay, it doesn't know what health is. There we go. So, uh, there we go. And delete this. So, if, if, if you come in trigger with die, lose a bit of health. <laughs> What's up with the dot storm? Okay, so if you collide with die, uh, you're gonna lose 10 health. The problem with this is you're gonna be using an attack that. So if you end up walking into your own attack, you'll take damage. I'm gonna have to somehow make it where you do a different attack than what they do, but it's based on the same prefab. So. Ah, okay, yeah, I think I just realized it. I think I just figured out how to do it. Okay. So, uh, just go to the player, wherever the player is, here. Drag on your health. Health is worth zero. And when we play the game, it should be worth or equal to 100. No, it wasn't. Because as you see there, we instantly got a, a camera not found shit, which means it didn't equal it. So let's do equals equals 100. This might just give us back another error. Um, It should be if health. See, do I, do I always do it backwards? See, I always do alligators backwards, so thank you very much for that. Uh, it should be... Yeah, I don't know. Thank you very much, Rory. I always do these backwards, as I'm pretty sure I've said a million times here before. Okay, error. Problem with errors. So, what the problem is, is probably just that. Because I made it a double, it thinks health is a boolean. And it's just saying... Boolean to int cannot be done, but transfer and left hand of the computer or some shit. So wait for this little spinny circle to be finished. Boom. Come on. There we go. Play the game. And hopefully now we can actually play it. So are we in it? Boom. We're in it. And health is equal to 100. Okay. Okay, so now we can we can work upon this, and we can now add um, in here using a Unity Engine dot UI, and what that does is we can now convert everything into strings. So uh, public. Uh, Unity engine dot UI dot text and that is gonna be called a uh, health um, I'm just gonna call it health text easy way around it health text and then I'm gonna add do I need anything else don't think I need anything else so Shit, didn't mean to do that. So here I just go um, 
hell text dot text uh, is equal to health to string save. So now that pretty much just gives me the ability to update in the game my health on the screen so I can constantly see what my health is at without needing to like press I to go into inventory or any of that. So uh, let this update. And then we go to my player. Because we're going to have to drag in the, uh, the health to it because it's looking for a text field right here. So we go here, canvas uh, health num, which is currently at 100. Let's just make that zero so it matches. Let's go player, health num, boom, close this, apply it so all players have it in the game. Uh, delete, there we go. So again, I will be updating this once this video is done. So if you want to go and get it and test it and let me know if you found any bugs, it would be pretty good. So now, as you can see, you can't see because my uh, face cam's in the way. My bad. Um, camera. There we go. So as you can see there, we have 100. So if I go out of this, we haven't any way to take damage yet, as, as far as I know. But if we go um, here, make this, let's say, 50. Boom. Back into the game. It updates. Without needing to, let's make it 75. Without needing to do anything, so you can you can barely see it, but it's you can you can see it. Okay, so now we can make it where. Uh, welcome back, sketches. So now we can make it where we can uh, probably eat stuff and then gain health from that if you guys want. Um, or we can make it as a way where we can double our health and we can. Like actually upgrade it and kind of make it seem like you're wearing armor, so you take less damage, but you you still will be taking the same amount of damage. Um. Okay, I'm trying to. What did I add there? I added a health system, but it's not fully implemented yet. It it, it is implemented. Um, do you have a pencil there, Neve? Just so actually, sorry, I have, I see one right here, right here beside me. There we go. Okay. So I'm just taking off health system. Okay. So now I'm going to add in a hunger system. Uh, where's chess? For fuck's sake. Um, so now I'm going to add in a void hunger. So void hunger. Um, I'm also going to add an int up here and go uh, hunger. And I'm also going to grab this and make it uh, hunger as well. Hunger text. Make that a capital. My bad. And now just go here, copy this, and then swap out the uh, two hungers. Or the two healths for hungers, so hunger dot text and hunger. Mm, there we go. Also, want to go up here and go hunger is equal to 100, so you have 100 percent. Yeah, 1001 chap would never need to eat again. Um, okay, so up here. Okay, we go um, hunger. No, not the function. Hunger uh, is less than or equals to uh, one. Fucking. Blah. There we go. I pressed it right the first time. Oh my god, dinotube.com. Best website you'll ever get. Um. Okay, so, what's the crack basher? How you doing, buddy? So now in here, we want to go um, invoke repeating, then, um, I think in brackets, hunger, 
and then another bracket and then five and then six and then close bracket close bracket close this me we will see if that works I don't fucking know if it will but we will find out so between every five to six seconds lose one hunger might have to increase that to maybe every 10 seconds or so down the line I haven't no any new shit so the text did not update because there is an error and it's not showing me what the error is for some reason uh, console here we go I have five errors okay what are they I have two errors no overload matching hunger uh, takes two arguments and an overall meta takes one argument okay so let's just make this five every five seconds repeat it. Uh, that might not have to be in a in a bracket apart from it. It might have to be in the same bracket, but just with a little exclamation -y shit at the bottom of it. So we will find out now. Okay, I think I think this doesn't go here. I think this just uh, goes like that. Then this doesn't need to be here, and then this just does. Uh, let's make it seven. And then save. Let's see if that fixes it. Probably not, because we've only done invoke repeating once, and my brain barely fucking remembers it. So I'm just going off what I roughly remember. Okay, the best overload. Okay, um, the best overloaded method matches uh, your hunger method that you declared doesn't take arguments. What you mean? Um, is there a thirst bar? There will be. I'm just adding in hunger now, and then I'm adding in thirst, and then in oxygen, one after that. Um, like all I wanted to do is just repeat the uh, the hunger every few seconds. So you should need to set it up where you declare the method like uh, <laughs> a thirst for pussy. Um, they said it. Okay. I, I I ended up putting in something wrong. I'm just looking up invoke repeating for one sec. Invoke repeating. Oh, fuck. I hate this fucking. <clears throat> invoke repeating. There we go. Um. Void hunger start time end time. Do I need to do that in it? I shouldn't have to. It should just it should just work. There's no it, oh really Unity sound. There's no example of it in their on their website. Um okay so here we go um example that projectile start invoke dot projectile wait am I using the I'm in fucking yeah my bad. My fucking bed. There's meant, there's meant to be an F after these. And this needs to be in the fucking quotation y shits. My keyboard is broke to the people who do not notice. Okay, there we go. That should be it right there. So save. Sorry about that. Hopefully, that, sh that gets it. man computer also sorry if my screen's a little bit stretched it's i have a weird screen size so anytime i do these videos i'm constantly like should i make it full screen so e everybody can see like every bit of detail or should i make it where the only see the important parts but like have a little bit of the screen cropped out so we got to work in here i ended up putting in the wrong uh i didn't have it as a the quotation -y bitches so uh, we have we have health, and then we're gonna have to add hunger. So let's do hunger right below it. While I'm at it, I'm also gonna pick up this and move it a little bit higher, so I can move this a little bit more down. So this is just gonna be changed to hunger, 
and player I drag this in here and I press apply and that should be it done I hope we'll go into the game and we'll we'll fix the errors from there so uh, delete and play uh, yo flan you know the game I was making I finished it is it is there anywhere people can get it or is it just okay so every five to seven seconds we should lose one in hunger and it's doing the same thing it done in my old game. After five to seven seconds, it'll just constantly go boom. As you can see, I'm getting laggy. Also, yeah, shit, you guys can't even see what's happening right now. Right now, my hunger's at minus 700. So I do know why um, this didn't work. The reason it didn't work is because it isn't in um, start function. Um, hello, what's the crack king? It's the crack motherfucker. Give the video a thumbs up. Please. Um, king, there's going to be a new updated version of this game um, once this video is done. So if you want to go and get it, and if you and Risky can play it, maybe even do a video on it, and just kind of tell me what bugs you find in it, it would be good. Okay, so um, I'm just going to pause the game, move my face cam, and play it. So now we will see if it works. Okay, so let's see. There we go, we lost one. Now another five or six seconds. Boom! We did it. So now we have a uh, hunger system. I'm going to grab the health and the hunger and move it down to the bottom of the screen where my uh, face is currently right now just so we can actually see it while I'm testing it. So let me go player. Uh, let me go player. Let me go here. Canvas. Uh, health. Uh, and hunger. Drag that down to the bottom move it over a little bit I probably might make this into a health bar down the line but um for the time being I'm gonna just leave it as it is it works uh, is that the game I played last time yeah I have completely added in a new world to it no longer just a little crappy square we have a fully uh, detailed island I haven't put trees in it yet what's the correct Bren I haven't added trees into it yet, so it's just a a normal island. Um, I'm just adding in rain, and you can kind of see it in the video. It's kind of like a, a sun effect to when you look up at the rain. It kind of like makes a glare. It doesn't really do it this when you look up that direction, but when you do it this way, it does it. Okay. Like when you played it, we were on a, we were on like a little a 4x4 four four island. Now we're on a, an actual fucking, if you can see this, full-sized island. Also, see there's, there's a color different difference here? That's the sand, and this is just kind of like a normal grass. I will be going in and adding like proper detail. Maybe add like, uh, like stones or like a coral reef or something in the water, but at the time being... I'm not really going to be adding in a swimming mechanic anytime soon, so that's not anything to worry upon. Okay, so we've done a hunger system. Uh, now we can add more to that, and we can go, if hunger is less than this, every few seconds, take something away from health. Uh, and yeah, Flan, I'll play it uh, whenever I get free time right now doing my GBGBG and revising last time. Nice man. Okay. So now we literally go and copy this but make it um health loss. And then we go in here we go if hunger is shit. I'm, I always get these equals two or less than's wrong. 
Okay, if health is equals to or less than zero, uh, health, health equals minus two. So we're going to lose two health for every two seconds that, or every five or six seconds. I don't know. I haven't really decided yet, but now we just go up here. Uh, to the invoke repeating right here copy this paste it and for every every four to five seconds we will lose um uh, we'll lose two health so uh, here we go here paste and save so now we will slowly lose health if our hunger gets below a certain point um you started your exams on Monday, Flan. Have you been fishing before? I have been fishing before. A few times. Actually, quite like it. Um, I caught a crab before. Crabs are pretty cool. We didn't eat it. We just kind of... It's like a thing you do down in Wicklow. Uh, at a certain time of the year, you go fishing. You catch crabs with, like, buckets and, uh, like, a little fishing rod with, like, cheese or whatever on the hook. And then once you catch it, you just kind of, like... Yeah, you just kind of throw back. You see whoever catches the biggest one, like, wins or something. I don't know what it was. But, um, okay, our hunger is currently 100. We've lost one, as you guys saw. So now let me go in, make it, uh, let's make it, um, two. Okay, we're at two now. We're at one, and then when we go below it, let's see if we start losing health. So we're at zero, and now we're losing health. Okay. One thing now we uh, have to fix is once our health goes below um, zero, or once it gets to zero, not to go below zero. So, it's fairly simple to fix. What's correct, Graham? Hope you're having a good day, man. Please give the video a thumbs up. So, an update we do um, right here we just literally copy this function put it up here and go if health is equal to or less than zero no no my bad my bad we just go we go here and we go if hunger is greater than or equals to zero hunger is equals to zero and that's an update so that will constantly be happening to counteract it from going below it. So hopefully this will work. Um, just remember King, you can always repeat the exams, but you can never repeat the sesh. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, I've caught a Gardog, but never ocean fishing. Uh, but tomorrow I'm going to, oh, it's in Texas, a popular American city, and uh, you can do deep sea fishing. Um, I'm having a good day. Uh, what about you? I'm doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. Just digging around making a new game. Okay, here we go. So start it up. Character hunger is on 100. Again, let's make it... Um, let's just make it 1 this time. Just to kind of save, ourself, save us a few seconds. So it is now on 0. We will start to lose health. And let's see if it goes below 0. Or if it constantly stays at it. Boom, we have fixed it. And now we slowly lose health. And once we do, we will just get deleted from the world. Now, we will... Who? Okay, I'm trying to think now. We could try implement if you come across a piece of meat, you can just eat it. Or we can do it where we can add in like a new tab here, which is called meat. And then you use that meat to craft like cooked meat. And then with that craft cooked meat, it puts up your health. Or we could try to do a very shitty inventory system, which at the moment I'm not 100% sure how to do that. Um. So where is... Uh, 
this. I'm going to just hire this up a little bit. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that. Okay. So we added a hunger system, food system, rain. Um, we could add fallen damage, I guess. Let's try add fallen damage. We could make it where when you're not colliding with anything for X amount of seconds. Just punch my keyboard as you do. Um, when you are not touching the ground for an X amount of seconds, do X amount of seconds times worth amount of damage. So the longer you fall for, the longer the damage will increase by because that's the longer you haven't been touching the ground for. <sighs> Complicated. So... Uh, let's make a another. What's the crack, Eddie? By the way, I saw your comment, but I forgot to say hi. Um, Flan, I got seep. Nice. So let's call this fall uh, damage. <laughs> fall dam. Fall damage. Fucking be able to spell would be good. Okay, that isn't going to be. Oh, it has to be an int because it can't be a float. Shit. Okay, fuck it. This is, uh, we can't make our health a fucking float. We could make it a float, but it's just gonna go all arseways because if you end up doing fall damage and it's you fall for like 0 0.2 seconds, or I mean, if you fall for 2.5 seconds, it's gonna take 2.5 health off you, which is then gonna try take 2.5 off of a full number, and you can't have. You can't have 97.5 health. It's either 97 or it's 98. You can't have in between. So we're kind of fucked. Ugh, been playing the new 8 remaster zombie maps. Oh, Eddie. Sharon is Karen, mate. Just fucking Sharon is Karen. Um, is there... Is there going to be a poop mechanic in the game? No. There, I'm not making arc at the moment. Um, I want to make these capitals because I like the first letters being capitals. It's, it's easier for me. Okay, so there's a little fucking bug on my... It's a little ladybird. The second it saw me, it was like, be still as invisible. <laughs> Pretend you don't see him. Look it's at so it. Insulting. Look at it. Aww. It's so small. You, you, you embarrass him. It's like, I'll get you for this! <laughs> okay. Um, I got a main month. I gotta wait on my daddy. Okay. Flan, have you been hunting before? No. Yeah, I just got fire done working. I got a keynote, I shame. I. Hunting? No. The. I could never kill like a rabbit. I fucking love rabbits too much. Uh, have you made the character able to swim? Not yet. Not yet. Right now you just kind of fall underneath the water and you just get like a um, a blue blur effect on your screen. So, um, okay, we need to do... Okay, we need to copy this and just make this on collision. It said on trigger, so void on trigger, or I mean on collision, fucking on co collision. Okay, so on collision, exit when you're not. See, this is how I don't know. I don't know how to do when you're not colliding with something. Like I know you could do on collision exit, and that means when you when you leave it, you could then start a timer, and then when you re-enter it. That is the equivalent to how long your fall damage is. But the problem with that is, if you go from touching the ground to swimming, you're not touching the ground, and then when you go back to the land, the game goes, oh shit, he's just touched the ground. He's been swimming for 20 minutes. Do all 20 minutes time worth of damage, and then you just instantly die. So, I need to make it when you're not touching anything. Okay, for the time being, we're going to leave out fall damage until I look it up a little bit more um abandoned buildings um ok 
Okay, what else we got? What else we got? Underwater physics. Um, rain. Okay, let's do rain glare. And then maybe mist. Flan, do you know who Savitar is yet or no? No, I don't. I didn't know Flash was back. <laughs> don't. Don't. Please, King. Flam, when you get into new maps, until when you give them to me, Eddie, it's like Sharon's caring, man. Okay. So now, save this. I need to go and make a new image. So, new image. Bloop. Uh, bloop. Delete. Where that little bug? Okay, here's. Um, delete. I just don't want him at my doodles. You didn't realize. Mm, sure. We don't ask doodles. <laughs> the horror. <laughs> I'm making a little shitty glare at the moment. Yeah, man, you should make a cave in it, uh, and instead of the weird beasts from the forest, you have a, a big flan in the cave. What the fuck? Uh, Weber for Pornhub. Uh, we still need those, don't we? Wait, what? Flan, do you know? I it wasn't gonna spoil or anything. Don't worry. I I'm confused. Okay, but now we need to just add like a little. This isn't the most beautiful list, whatever I'm adding right here, but it'll do the job. Also, on your screen, it looks like an oval. It isn't. It's a perfect circle on my screen. So, uh, that just shows how much my screen is stretched for you guys. Okay, so I need to just remove this little pixel right here, because that's a nine the balls out of me. I need to go over here to this blend, make it a little bit smaller. I just blur this a little bit so it's not as janky. So, and there we go. Um, while I'm at it, I'm actually gonna go uh, over this whole circle. While I'm at it, actually, just make my fucking brush. Ugh. Fuck. Okay, make my brush decent size so I can do it all in like five, six seconds without taking a week and a half to do it. Okay, make my brush a little bit smaller again. Go back over this. Okay. Um, kind of looks like a bubble. We can use this maybe also for when we're underwater. Um, let me just add in uh, like one more line straight down here. And then uh, maybe ramp it up and curl it here. And then about there. I so fucked that up, but screw it. Let's just fill that in. Um, can we remove rid of this again? There we go. Uh, flip the bitch. So uh, flip. Bring it over here. Rotate it a small bit. Uh, bring it down. And do again what I done with the last one. Just go in and smooth it. Get rid of all that fucking janky shit. Okay, now we make a layer. Just plop all them in. Fuck. Plop all them into it. And turn down the opacity. Just so barely seeable. So about 50 should do. Um, we will see. So, uh, save as, uh, rain, uh, face rain, fuck it, face rain, temp, there we go, and now save as that and put it in operation, dead shot, there we go, and save, I got to go, got my, got, college and work uh, tomorrow see you people later see you later sketches 
uh, I got me college event to make uh, me officially join animation game design course and oh boy I wasn't expecting to get it. <laughs> Did you get in man? <laughs> phase rain. Face rain, not phase. Okay, so now that's gonna do it shit. Uh, hey Flan, have you seen the new alien movie? I'm seeing it tomorrow. It's a it's a who? So is Graham. Oh, okay. That new alien movie's a the one I showed you and you were like, Nope, I'm not watching that. Yeah. But then I showed you again and you were like, I might actually watch that. Not the one with Ryan Reynolds in it. The, uh... The actual Alien Predator series. One. The one... Oh, you didn't see the last movie, did you? Well, the one where the guy gets his head chopped off. But know, because, which, which, but what's it called, sweetie? Prometheus? Prometheus? Also, if the camera slightly moves over, like... Damn it, George. I'll be very close to anyone later. <laughs> You're like, bitch, I'm... <laughs> I don't know if I've seen it, but it's okay. It's very hard not to see old titties when you... I said I don't think I've seen it, but it's okay. I was talking about Prometheus, not the titties. Oh. <laughs> My bad. Permitted titties. Permit titties. Permit titties. <laughs> yeah, they permanently stuck in your face. Permit titties. They it's, have to make like um, bitch killer. Are you talking them. about Alien Covenant? Is that what it's called? Mm -hmm. Uh sip of the days, by the way. Seeing Alien Saturday and yeah. I got and yeah, I got in so hyped about it. Nice man! Man, okay, so uh, phase rain, as what King was calling it, is right here. Very, very shitty textured, as you might be able to see down here in the bottom. It is 300k, it's very small. So, let's get a uh, cube. Uh, phase temp make that into an image or a material come on there we go delete this uh, go into here and now I can drag I need to find this material which is the fire okay so um, also I also I also drew a where's that little bug I don't want to kill him I also drew like a little uh, sketch of an alien's head actually today from Alien. I didn't even mean to. I was just halfway through drawing sketches as like things I want to add to the game. I don't know how well you'll be able to see it. Doesn't look the best on camera, but it looks pretty cool on this. Let's see. I didn't see what you did. The alien's mouth. I like it. Oh, also done weapons last night while the old bitch ass was asleep. Oh, poison! You're gonna yeah, be you're, you're gonna be able. To, uh, I was thinking you might be able to run up and poison uh, people's meat when they when they uh, place it, and then kill them. Um, I've been waiting for that movie. Congratulations, King! Uh, yeah, Alien Covenant. Oh, okay. Fuck, I went off the screen. Okay. Um, I'm out of the knee. Can't watch any more. Sorry. Bye, Flan. See you later, man. Okay. So. Um. Click this. Come on. There we go. Um. Phase rain. Phase. Uh, phase rain. There we go. Throw it in here. And as you can see. It is not working, so I need to go uh, click it. I need to make it transparent. So, um, 
Wait, can I just go water? Nah, that, that's not going to be that easy. Um, I can go unlit and then texture. Or I mean, uh, I mean uh, transparent. So again, it's not the not the best, but kind of looks like little bubbles are kind of on your character's face. Um, I also want to. Where is this? I also want to make it where they're not falling as fast. So start speed is zero. I don't want them to fall that fast. I want them to fall like really slow. Maybe a little bit higher. And then increase the speed a little bit. Okay, you know what? Let me put that back. Wait a sec. Okay, I need to go into the shape and uh, make the box uh, not so wide. I also need to make it not that long, so it's mainly in front of her or him, or whatever the fuck gender my character is. Um, and I want to make this maybe uh, five. So most of me on the screen is five. It's kind of works. Um, okay. You know what? Let me make it a uh, ten, and let me go uh, start size. Uh, between two variables. So start size can be 0 0.1, actually 0 0.5, and 2. So you can get really small ones or really fucking big ones. As you can see, there is a uh, like fairly small ones, but to keep disappearing before you uh, before you get to the end of your screen. So increase that a little bit. See, but now it looks like they're falling too fast. Okay, about here, and let me just move this down a little bit, and increase this a little bit. See, it still seems like they're falling a little bit. Oh, I'm a fucking idiot. Okay, I can just make how long he can live for a little bit longer. Um, two seconds. There we go. But that is way more than 10 as far as I can see. Or maybe not. I don't know. And let's make this 7. Um, 5. Whoa, not 75. 5. There. That, that seems somewhat uh, decent. I'll have two videos going up tomorrow, Flan. Don't forget to check them out. I won't, man. Is that the car caribou cell video thing you were talking about the other day? Um, so, rain glare added. So now I will... Actually, I need to write this down. Uh, timer. Timer weather. So now I need to have a gen generalized weather system. So when it rains for me, it rains for other players. And... If I might add like a heat system, it'd pretty much just be my hunger system, but if I'm not like within a certain radius of my fire, I will uh, start to take uh, like heat damage or uh, coldness damage and then um, I can have it that when you're touching the fire to slowly replenish your, uh, your heat factor. That's literally very fucking simple to do. It's just gonna be a bitch to make it where uh, it'll work for both players single player perfectly fine so there now when it rains you have kinda like a kinda like a glare on your screen but the problem is you can look up and it doesn't really go with you so like you can notice that it's not on your screen so 
my dumbass forgot to do this. Uh, parent it to your camera. So now when I actually rotate up and rotate back, it goes with you so you can note it. So it will, it'll actually look like it's, it's, it's hitting your eyes rather than it just kind of being able to like wrap around it. Uh, yeah, man, the car boot, uh, sail one and the vlog going up. Nice, man. Vlogs are so easy to do, but they're so good. Okay, at the same time, this didn't fucking work. Okay. So, I don't think I click apply, did I? Um, player. Player. Um, Rainmaker. Main camera. This. So, the problem is with this. To turn this particle system off is going to be a pain in the ass. Because it's actually... No, it wouldn't really... Just be get component then particle system. Um, okay, let me try this. So um, uh, copy component here, uh, paste component as new here, and uh, remove component. So let me see if this made it any better. Nope, didn't work at all. Okay, so I'm gonna go back into the world and make sure I haven't completely fucked over what I just made. Okay, we still have the bubbles on our screen. And the follow us as well, which is good. I could add a script into it when your X or Y position, whatever it is, of your um, uh, head, when you rotate it past a certain point, only to start showing the bubbles. And then when you go back down for them to, uh, to for it to stop. Um, I could do that. I could do that. Uh, let me just think here real quick. The fucking heat in this room is a different story. Uh, when did you start this game? I started this, what, a week ago? Five, six days ago? What day is it? Um, it was two or three days. Two day. Whenever I done the six hour live stream, Two days before that, so I, I think that was three days ago, that two early, or the six hour live stream, so I've started this five, six days ago. Because... Oh no, a, a week ago today. Or... Five or six, maybe a week, I don't know. Not long ago. So... I can then, I can now add into it where, it doesn't really make sense, but I can add into it where if it's raining, your, um, your hunger goes down more, doesn't really make much sense, but, me, I could also do it where, um, your hunger goes down every, it goes down two, every second, In, or two every, um, every bit because it's a little bit short um okay game looking good thank you very much i have like i want to add a I thought i heard something um i want to add mist to it god rays simple enough add more materials or kind of make the uh, i could add grass to the whole world i can do this real quick um not really something I want to do. Um, Alright, I'm off. Gonna get up early for exams. Have a good night, everyone. You too, King. Good luck, man. Okay. So, I could do this, but it, it breaks my game because these trees aren't very, um, very optimized to have so many of them. So, if I click terrain, go to trees, change bin to um, trees... And then if I go uh, lobby and play, you will now notice I'm in a forest instead of a on an island, and it looks a million times better. Like I obviously will now have to like upgrade the quality of the rain and the quality of the little bubbly bits, but um, it look it looks pretty good. When you ha when I have these trees on it, but you can instantly notice that it runs 
not as good because there's so many of them on the island. Like I already, I have them placed on the island already, but I have it kind of set up where until I get better trees or like more PC friendly for not as good PCs, I just have them not uh, being used in the game at the moment. So I just need to turn them back off so my PC doesn't fucking explode. So uh, make that, whatever that is, are these, um, hopefully, whoa, what the shit? Uh, hopefully these are invisible, the new things I made, the trees. And uh, no, we good as far as I can see, but as you look, it's laggy as shit. Okay, maybe the things I just added were seeable. Uh, why is the game so laggy? Um, have you got the script for inventory, uh, or is that, uh, is that too, or is that too close to be added for now? Um, right now I just have kind of like. Okay, one second, and I'll explain it. Um, I need to find bin because that's what I had this set as earlier, and it was yeah. See, it runs twenty times better. I think that bottle was being uh, made, but it was just so small you couldn't notice it. Um, uh, let me go lobby. I need to, I need to fix some shit. Okay, what I have right now as my inventory is, uh, as you can see here, I have wood, stone. Actually, I don't know. I would make a full screen, but I'd end up losing what I have. But uh, I have it set as um, wood, stone, metal. And then in my script, I have it where it goes, every frame of the game, save this number, whatever number goes after them. Right now, it's zero because the game isn't playing. But save that number, and uh, next time we play the game, load up what you previously saved them as. So I could, in theory, use that to save your position. So if you're playing in a game, and it was a game that you and someone didn't finish, but you wanted to finish it later on. Bodies could just be like, okay, quit. It would save where he is where in the game, and then he's loaded back up and he's been in the exact same spot. But the problem with that is, I'm not going to add that, because I want the game to literally just be you versus one other person, or like two people versus two other people. You just both fight it out, and then once it's done, the world gets wiped. Then you start again from scratch, and you just... You just keep doing it, and I'm gonna make it where there's a leveling system. So, the longer, like, the more times you play the game, the more trees you cut down, the more stones you mine, the more bases you build, the more things you will unlock. So, you like later on, like, see, right now my level is 1800. Right, like, my level's only that because it's it, the script is honestly broken. Um, I'll actually f try fix that script now. So, um, leveling, 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 where the fuck, okay, there it is. So right here, I have a variable that is uh, experience. I have a variable that is level, and a variable that is level gap. Level gap is the distance that you need to get your experience to until you get to the next level. So... Okay, so right here, it is so fucking warm. Um, maybe my script does work. Maybe it's just not in the right order. So maybe this just needs to be here, and that should. Because right here I have update. Set your... Uh, okay, also this shouldn't be really inventory. It should be a level. So I'm going to have to copy all of these and put it in here. Which should reset my current level back to level uh, 1. Because I've completely rechanged the whole script. So right here I have... Um, that is equal to that. Okay, so experience text is equal to experience, level text is equal to level, and level gap is equal to level gap. So, and then here we have void experience gain. So anytime you cut down a tree 
or place an item, you end up gaining experience. And um, that should be it. Also, this is a mono behavior. It's not online behavior. Actually, I don't think I pressed the save there. It's a mono behavior, so it might not work online, but we'll find out. So warm. Hi, is it? Hi, is it jellyfish? No, I'm okay. Okay, so now when we load up the game, it's okay. Thank God for a second. I thought my player was still in the uh, the scene. We would end up losing all of our inventory. So now when we load up, hopefully we are level one or level zero or one. I don't know what I've set it up as. So there we go. We are level one. Our level gap is one hundred. And our experience is currently zero. So let's um, start placing down some floors. As you can see right there, we didn't get any experience. So we have a we have a fuck up in our script somewhere. So let me just check to make sure everything is still working because normally it everything's grand. But now when I load into the game, we have an extra hundred. Yeah, see, we have an extra hundred in everything. So. I don't know why that is. I think it's here. If level is equal to zero, level gap equals... Um, if level equals zero, level gap equals 100, and that equals that. Okay, you know what? Let me just get rid of that, because I think... I honestly think that's what's fucking it up. So, if experience... If experience is greater than... Or... Wait a minute. Everything is fucking perfect. I just had to fucking alligator run. Fucking alligators. Swear to God. Okay, so now when I load into the game, I actually don't know what is going to happen. It's either going to refix itself and we're going to be level 1. We're either going to be level 200 or level 101. So let's see. Actually, let me just check that script to make sure there's nothing else where the alligators are backwards. Nope. Okay. So now, when we play the game, we're going to have to remake our, uh, uh, remake ourselves level 1 again, if, it, if not already. Okay. As you can now see, we are currently going up levels at the speed of fucking sound. Lights go out and I can't be saved. There's a chat to spin Okay, that didn't work. Why did that not work? If experience The alligator eats the bigger number? So did I, did I have this right the first? I don't fucking know, motherfucker. I almost said a certain word I'm not allowed to say on YouTube. Well, I'm not allowed to say on YouTube. It's just... Mm. Butterflies. Such an evil word. Okay, so let's see. Okay. So as you can see, our level is fucking ridiculous as always. So level, our level, our experience is zero, our level is one, and our level gap is one hundred. Boom. Set it at that. Okay, that is perfect. Okay, so it's so fucking warm in this room. Okay, let me press play and again hope oh thank you very much for the other thumbs up wherever this gave to me or the other two thumbs ups i should say okay and again it fucking didn't work i don't know why it's doing this okay so experience is zero level is one and level gap is 100 okay so there obviously is something in the script i'm not doing right so, 
Yeah, Eddie. Okay, so I actually think it is this. If level is not... If level is equal to zero, level is equal to one, and then level gap is equal to 100. I think that is what's fucking it up, because the game is like, no, you've previously had it at, as this, so override it with this, but that wouldn't explain why my level is getting to be 100. Uh, open the window, man, uh, if it's warm. But then the dogs, yeah, fuck it, go on. If that long legs gets in, I don't give a shit at this point. I'm not getting I know, no. I know you will. Open the window. I actually can't. Open the window, please. I'm about to pee. That's your excuse for me opening the window for a bit to pee. Yes. <laughs> it's not gonna pee on me yet, okay. Does the, 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 did my excuse work? No, not really. Did I was you, getting a butt ready. Did you open the window? Mm -hmm. Then it worked. Is <laughs> <laughs> it after I've opened it? Okay, this this leveling isn't working at the at the time. I will fix it down the line. Um so there was something I was adding something I was adding and then I got distracted by the leveling um I don't know what the fuck was it doing again also I want to go into my inventory real quick um the is this is this inventory one? No, this is the wrong one. Okay, so if I go to the control here, see game object dot send message experience gain. Copy here. Experience gain. Experience plus equals ten. That didn't even work. Have you ever used a staff on an origin zombie map? I think I have once the other day. Okay. So as you can see here... should work but I think it only works when I use um the, the wall for some reason so let me just show you is what I mean so if I go uh, here place a floor boom I didn't gain any experience if I go in here don't pick a wall boom I gained 10 experience like I should like I can gain like my leveling system works fine like look I hit one more I get one more experience and I level up. I get one more, boom I level up. Like it works, but for some reason the saving isn't working. And for some reason only building a wall gives me experience. So there is a little bit of fuckery going along here um bitch can you open the, the shits it's how we okay so if that is greater than level cap that is equal to that and that equal to that so that right here works flawlessly I don't it just said open the window and take it down. <laughs> not take it down off the wall. I could reach. Take it. No, do not the wibble the up. <laughs> what, we, what we was doing? <laughs> the wibble on hot Nope. Um. No. What? Hey. <laughs> I don't know why this isn't working. 
It's annoying the bells off me. So, we've been doing this for an hour and a half, okay. And we have four people watching still, which is, um, surprising, to be honest. And two of them were you. Yeah, two of them are you, and one of them, one of them are me, and the other one's Eddie. <laughs> so we have one person watching the stream. Um. Hey, am I not a person? No, um. Cute. We'll add a timer. No. So, for shit. Okay, we'll add a timer now so that after a certain amount of seconds, seconds, after a certain amount of seconds, uh, you can't take any damage up until this time. So, I'm still too warm. what? I'm still too warm. What? I'm still too warm. Oh. Do you think I'm say? stuck to the worms. I'm like, what the fuck? I'm stuck to the worms. Bit, yeah, I thought you were talking about the jellies. Like, I'm stuck to the worms. <laughs> At least it makes sense. Flan, you and Neve can. Conversations. Conversations are tap net. Uh, I'm watching, man. Oh, no. Okay, you're still here. Nice. Okay, so I'm going to add a. I should have a game manager right here. There we go. We have placeable objects on it. I don't know what the fuck that does. Okay, so we're gonna add a C sharp. The only reason I'm doing this in C sharp is because it has predictive text and it's a lot easier. So, um, a damageable timer, a timer damage, damage timer, um, allow damage, allow damage timer. Sure, that'll do. I'm gonna turn off my webcam for about a week and a half just while I um, snort some cocaine. I was gonna say snort some heroin, then my brain was like, is that even a thing? Actually, is that a thing, guys? Let me know. Can you snort cocaine? Oh, wait, not cocaine. Can you snort heroin? Okay. I think you can. Snort Snorting cocaine, you'd be dead. I like how she told you how to say that word. What word? Uh, conversations. <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> I'm the smart one. Hey! I know you're the smart one, but I'm good at reading and spelling. Bitch, I can't read fucking to save my life. It's okay. Not many people can. Except for 84 million people. And that's actually not even probably a guess. Like, just easily 84 million people in the world that can read. <laughs> There's also another 852 million to have their titties out right now, like you do. Shut up! There's the one thing I like about you, and I don't even like them much. You've been hit by, been struck by a smooth titty. Diddle 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 A smooth titty. Little, 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 Yeah, you actually do that so well. It's unreal. You are half turtle. I know. Turtles are also known as known as bitches. So you, so you half bitch. I'm half bitch. Okay, <laughs> I'll take that. You're a half a super bitch. Doesn't that make me look all bitch? Yes. <laughs> okay, so public player. Oh no, uh, public uh, game object, and then. Uh, uh, Player. Okay, so here we just go. Uh, player is equal to game object dot find find game objects with sound. Also with sound with tag. This is also this uh, with tag, and then we just do this, do that, do this. Go here, do the double bitches, and go in here and go player. So find everyone who has player. And then, um, 
am. Then we get rid of this. Then we go a uh, yield. Yield. Wait. Why can't I um? Why can't I do this? Uh, wait. Wait until what the fuck is wait for se yeah wait for seconds boom. Oh, wow, what the fuck was all that? And then why, why I L? Why is it capitals? Y E I L. Yield. Wait for seconds. Um, a down bike race pro yo. Hi. Uh, am I late? Not really. I only started a little while ago. Okay, so wait for seconds. Um, so I want it to be like 15 minutes. So 15, 60. Oh shit, this is uh, 800. 15. And if you look at me, you know, 15 <laughs> by 60. 60 by 10 is 650 by the 300, 900. No, yeah, 900. Okay. Will you let, look that up for me? What? Um, 60 by um, 15 is about 900. Um. Int and then time. So this, the amount of time you have to wait for is time, and then I can, I can change what that is. True. Sixty by fifteen. Sixty by fifteen, about nine nine hundred. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, Grant. Let me check. Hello, I'm late. Yeah. No, I go to. What do you, what game you, uh, have you made any games? Like, I'm pretty sure you were saying there a while ago. You you have. Yield. Wait for seconds. All that should be fine. All that should just work. If I'm, if I'm right, we should now have a workingable um, damage script. So, also, I do need to add one more thing. I just, yeah, there we go. I'm waiting for that. Expecting this, this, that, or this. Okay, so, huh? Okay, let me uh, annotate you. And save. You've made seven. What ones, man? Okay, there we go. So we could make another void, void um timer there. And then just do this, uh, do that, uh, go back up one line, go over here real quick. Um, first thing we just want to do is uh, send, oh no, um, um, player dot send message. Wait, why isn't that working? Player dot send message, no? Uh, there are, yeah, they're in Ken Academy. What's that? Player dot send send a message. Why is it not coming up? Um, here we go. Sorry about this. Unity send message. Send message. Okay, maybe it's send message first. Send message dot play send message. Oh, will this just do it? Okay, maybe it will. 
um, send message um, and then this had apply damage then after a few seconds okay so um, this will be uh, this will be pretty much damage on damage on damage underscore on and this needs to be in the uh, the quotation -y shits and then after um and then make it time and save okay so now we need to go back into our um our player player's health whatever we just made that script as and Neve, if you read this go smack flan in the head sound um, I can finally live stream but I'm sick so I won't stream all week man I know how that feels there is nothing worse wanting to stream and your body's just like no not happening Player's health, that's what we called it. Okay, so let me open up that script. So now we want to add another part to this. So now we want to. Oh shit, my fucking thing crashed again. Uh, I really love the new version of Unity. It crashes every chance it gets. Speaking of which. Actually, Unity doesn't crash. It's just Mono Develop. Mono Develop is the coding language for it. Okay, so now open up Player. Okay, so what I need to do now is just minimize this real quick. Go back to Game Manager. Go here and go um. What did I call that? Um, allow damage or something? Allow damage timer. There we go. Players is uh, gonna be a random, depending on how many people there is. Um, why am I smacking fan? Are like pals? Are your pal? Yeah, man. So we're gonna set this to ten seconds, just for the time being. We this I do want it to be. I might. I might make like a mode depending on if you pick like hardcore, easy, or normal. This will change if hardcore would be like a minute, and you have a minute to gather resources before you can start killing each other. Um, so this is just gonna be set to that. Now we need to go in here and grab. Uh, we actually need to open up that script. The allow time. For some reason, it crashed. Or it closed. Okay, here we go. So now we go into here and we uh, literally grab damage on. Copy, go in here, make a new void, make it damage on. Open this and literally go uh, damage. No, 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 okay. So now we go up here and um, that's just a reason for smack him uh, I only have two friends now tree why would I hit him for fun <laughs> okay so now we go health loss so this way now we can have full control over it so um, do I have a start function uh, I don't have a start function okay so now let me just do void uh, start Okay, start. And now, uh, damage. Or, uh, sorry, um, health. Health loss is equal to zero. That's when the game starts. And now, in here, we go, uh, health loss is equal to. Health loss is equal to. And now I want to make a, um,. Oh wait, this is hunger loss, my bad. Health. 
health loss. Why did that know what health loss was then? Very confusing. Um, health loss is equal to oh, it was grabbing that function health loss. Okay, um, that might fuck us up down the line. So uh, health loss, make sure it's referring to the right one. As you can see here, we're getting like a little fucking error bitch um, in the name. Oh, the reason it's doing that is because there's two health losses. So health loss one. And then just add a 1 to the end of all these. Health loss 1 is equal to 10. And we also want to grab this and go when we collide with a die. So health loss is equal to health. Uh, H E A L. Health uh, plus. Plus or minus? Yeah, plus minus health loss one, and health loss one is equals to minus ten. So you're gonna be plusing a minus ten away. So we will um, uh, we will save this and uh, watch my game break because I know I fucked up something. Thank you very much for the thumbs up. Um, to amuse the people watching. Nah, that's mean. Also, I'm kind of not a. Oh, okay. It's a good thing my camera is on. What? It's a good thing my camera's on. Oh, what do you mean? Hmm. Did you do it on? No, it's not on. Okay, you Pro said good you thing your camera's on. I know, I was making a joke. Okay. Excuse me. You're not appropriately dressed. No. My camera's on. Hmm. <laughs> I'm getting more alcohol, fuck this. Ooh, we got an error. What is this, bitch? Um, a member health attack start is already defined. I have never moved my toes so fast before in my life to make sure they did not get broken. Holy shit, everyone is deaf. They are gonna kill me. <laughs> oh, I'm blind as shit. The dog. That dog never sleep. Yeah, I know. The one time the poor dog was asleep, I'm at the I'm at the waking in it. I'm at the breaking every. I'm at the breaking me toes. I'm at, I almost said me toe lobes. Because <laughs> it's hot ear lobes. Flan gonna get that dick sucked again. What was that? My ears hurt. <laughs> I dropped my keyboard. I keyboard. Okay. So now we're in the game. Let me go up here. And. And click player. So health loss is equal to zero. So right now it is working. So if we're fighting someone, we shouldn't be taking any damage if they're hitting us right now. We'll give it another few seconds, because I really don't know how long 10 seconds is. So, we'll give it until my hunger is at 42, just to be on the safe side. Or 92, I mean. So, there we go. Now, our uh, health loss is still equal to that. Okay, so it didn't work. Um, it found player. It found... Our player clone but I the thing I don't think what worked is in here it doesn't know where I'm sending the message to that's the problem so um now you have a new shit fuck up um you haven't <laughs> you're just like oh okay do I put an F after this You can go fuck off, you're always hungry. The f 
C sharp. There we go. Uh, that and some, see, I know how to get it to work perfectly fine. In I just got two fucking YouTube notifications. I'm so, I, I honestly hate these. I hate the new YouTube shit. No offense to the two people who just sent me or I just got notified for, but it it just annoys the fuck out of me. I just keep getting fucking notifications. Okay, I'm gonna. Um. Okay, I'm gonna copy this script. And I'm gonna go and um, remake it, but as a Java. So, um, allow damage. Because I know how to get it to work in a Java. The only reason I done it in the C sharp, as I was saying earlier, is because I has the predictive text and it saves you a lot of time typing out full things like if you get the first two or three a fucking bitch crushed again swear to god fucking birch cropped again cropped again crushed again the birch I noticed the birch shit itself again it's a birch tree bird Hey, Bert. Hey, Ernie. <laughs> Not two Bert's voice. What's this Bert? Two Ernie's. Which one's Ernie? <laughs> the little fat one. Which one? Yeah, the what, one. Was that the first voice or the second one? <laughs> hey, Bert. <laughs> hey, Bert. You just sound like a... It's a Bert is more... It's like it's a foreign Patrick. Hey, Bert. Yeah. Hey, Ernie. That's just the way you were doing it. Okay, so this needs to be a uh, function. Also, no, I'm a fucking idiot. I'm a fucking idiot. I'm a fucking idiot. Right, right, right here. I didn't tell the script to run timer. So, I was meant to do this. I was meant to go timer, double bitches, and then this. Boom. That's all I needed to do. So, now I'll just let this save and we'll replay the game and hopefully this should work. So we'll see now. So we will play the game. I uh, damage dot on has no receiver. Okay, so pretty much what I was uh, worried about. Okay, so let me do a uh, public a variable um a player. And it is a game object. There we go. Um, I want it to be a this, but I don't know if this will work, but we'll find out now. Also, I can just go in here and copy this, because this will fucking save me a week and a half of retyping it. So, player is equal to game objects with tag. That's why I put the, the double brackets at the end. And now I do... Um, um, I can actually just do this, grab this, uh, go in here, go paste, change this from a void to a function. So paste, and now I'll go here and go uh, timer there, and um, actually no, you don't want that in the update because I'll try run it every fuck. I'll try run it every frame. So let's copy this, paste it up here with double bitches at the end. Get rid of function update. As far as I can see, I don't need that. I do need though the uh, variable uh, for time, uh, which is a int. And as far as I can see, 
player dot send message damage on time. Um, this might this should work maybe. I don't fucking know. So we'll find out. Let's see if this bitch worked. Who who likes dick? I don't. I'm a boy. <laughs> Motherfuckers say wood. <laughs> Bitch, you, got, you gotta love that poo poo poo. <laughs> Send message is not a member of that. that uh, um, did it, uh, it's fucking hot and like your soul. Um, this is a pain in my fucking buttocks. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Unity send mess message um, multiple multiple parameters. What the fuck, bitch? No, multiple game objects. I don't know what the fuck parameters means. Uh, game objects. Um, send message with multiple objects. Okay, let's see this. Um. Yep, that's what I meant. Wrap an argument. Okay, so if I do um, this, will that just work? Let me see. Let me motherfucking see. You sounded like um, Alex's birthday. Motherfucking, let me see. What? I don't have Morgan Free. I'm turning on my webcam. <laughs> the fuck? Random picture of a cat. Meow 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 meow. I don't ever remember drawing that cat. Um, I hate these. Like, yeah, there's a way to do it. Go to this link. Then you fucking have to go to another link, which sends you to another link. Um, uh, up, apply damage. I was literally just fucking on this. This does not help me in any way. Uh, is it possible to broadcast to all objects and multiple parameter with send object or send message? Okay, so... Here it is. Okay, so what they have, they have this within a a a, a fucking magic or jag. So let's see if this works. I don't. It's most likely gonna be like eighty-two errors, but we'll just see. Coding is fucking confusing as shit when it comes to. Unity. Okay, it didn't give me more errors. It just gave me the still default. It's missing a bitch at the end of it. Um. <laughs> 3D motion. Um. Let's see if that fixes it. it. Most likely won't. It's probably going to give me more errors. What do we will find out? Send message is not member of object. What the fuck? Um. Okay, the only way around it is literally doing this. Like, this right here will work, but only for one player. So, somewhere down the line, I will update this to work with multiplayer. So, where is my uh, pencil gone? There it is. So, um, where is this box? Add timer so you can't take damage up until timer ends. Has been added. So, now, let me just... Uh, 
play actually I need to go to level one or the main level go to game manager drag on that script apply damage player doesn't exist because um, obviously he's uh, not in the scene so now we just load back up the lobby we load back up the lobby save the game so thank you guys very much for the thumbs ups I'm gonna turn on my face cam in a minute also if there's anything you guys want me to add to the game I will um, I am going to add it where there's like animations and whatnot. I'm also probably going to remove the flashlight from my character's hand and just give him like an all around glow. Okay, so if we go in and click the uh, game manager, it should have found, there we go, it has found us. We didn't give it a time, sadly, so probably our damage is already, nope, our damage is still zero. Okay, so we've already fucked up by default. So, let me go back in here, game manager, make the time 10 seconds, and uh, go back to lobby. So in the script, we pretty much have it where it says, uh, you know what, actually, just remove this, uh, go here, and go uh, yield, um, yield, uh, wait for seconds, and then we go... Um, in here and we go time because time up here is the variable that we have set to 10 so after 10 seconds send and uh, make it less laggy what do you mean Nettie? what the fuck you mean Nettie? um so what the fuck okay player's health again has crashed <sighs> so we need to go player player health Open up player health. And it is fucking crashed. Again. What's this? Tur three? Four times in this video? Fuck no. Okay, so just give it a minute. There we go. Player's health. Open, please. The game isn't going to be as laggy as it, as it sees in the video. The only, only reason it's laggy is because I'm running mono develop, I'm running Ute, I'm running fucking Unity. I'm running like 18 versions of Chrome on top of it. I have I have GIMP open to make the textures. Like I have my computer is running like 10 different programs just to make the game. So the game isn't going to be uh, uh, this bad. Like probably add like 10 frames per second on top of it. So right here on start, health loss is equal to 10, or health loss 1 is equal to 10. And then down here, when damage on is sent, wait, why is this? Okay, this is a void. Can I do that? Can I go from Java? Fuck it, we're going to find out if we can go from Java to, um, from Java to C sharp with send message. Most likely not. So we're kind of fucked, but uh, we will find out. So, um, let me go ch -ch -ch game manage. No, nope. let me go uh, player. So, health loss is currently at zero. So we give it a few more seconds. There we go. Minus ten. It has been set. So, um, we pretty much have it now where it works. Now the only thing is, um, do we make it where we can? Okay, so now we go into player's health, and health loss is going to be equal to current attainable damage. This is going to be a new int I'm going to make, so this is going to be a, a bitch of an int. So, um, current... Obtainable damage. So, up table, obtain. How do you spell obtainable? O B. O B. Obtainable. Obtainable and. <laughs> I know, yeah. O B. O B. T A. T 
A I N A B L E. As you started saying, I was like, I'm a fucking idiot. Yeah, I'm not an idiot. English is stupid. Okay. So we go that is equals to that. Health is that plus health law minus health loss. And health loss is equal to current obtainable damage. And then that that should work with what I'm thinking. What I want to do is make it <coughs> down the line where you can, uh, like, there's gonna be like two or three routes you can go. You can either go through the like base route where you have a, a base built strong enough to kind of survive the enemies attacking you. Um, it's it's safe to say that Flan never won a spelling bee. Yeah, that's because of dyslexia. It's not my fault. Um. Uh, you can either go the um, the base building route, which is gonna like upgrade your base to make it where people can't break through it, upgrade your character to where he pretty much takes no damage from people attacking him, or the route where you can do so much damage that you kill people in like one hit. I don't know how you're gonna increase your damage, because people are gonna have like a base set. Like as I'm saying there, where you can only take a certain amount of damage. If you increase your armor, it's gonna be hard for people to have an. Uh, there, there is ways around it. It's just my brain's not wrapping its head around that. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay, so right now, what I need to do is actually go player. Uh, current obtainable damage is going to be uh, what? Normal damage you will be able to take is 10. 10 hits and you die. So actually, minus 10. Um, minus, minus 15 goes in what? 6, 7? Well, 6 and... 6 and 7, 5. So... 6.75 roughly? What's that? I need to fucking look this up now. Um, 100... Fuck off. Uh, 100... Divided by... Divided by... Divided... Divided by... Fuck. Divided by wouldn't work. Oh, 6 was there, but I want 6... Point... Point... No, no, by 15. And then that should give me 6.75 roughly. I hope. Six point yeah, eh, it was not far off. It was like one point two away, um, or one point, yeah, one point so one. Two yeah, six point two thirds. So, six point two thirds. Six point two thirds instead of six point three quarters. Um, when you're when you marrying Neve. <laughs> yeah. Good joke, Dark King. She's just my sad bitch. You choose my main bitch. Okay. Um. She provides us with money. I'm happy. YouTube doesn't <laughs> provide us with no money. Not much, but hey. We but appreciate every two cent we get. No, no, we don't. I'll be lucky to get like one cent from this whole like two chair video. Be lucky to get one cent from this whole thing. Mm. <laughs> this is way works. Okay, so if I set it to 15, you can take, because it's higher than a half, because this is higher than a half, you can take, you can take seven hits and then you will die. If your health is at a hundred, if it's not, you're fucked. So I'm going to set it to 10, because 10 seems to be a, a pretty, pretty, what the fuck? Uh, seems to be a pretty what the fuck I can't find YouTube. There we go. Uh, seems to be a pretty decent. Um, can I open up my game, please? Come on. It's it's frozen for some reason. Okay, so I'm gonna go into the level. I'm gonna add a. Uh, I'm gonna make a duplicate. Go over here to this. I'm gonna drag it. 
Because over here, this is just going to be a somewhat um, basic enemy, I guess. Uh, this is going to be, uh, this is going to let me take damage off it. And up here to the game manager, I'm going to set this to uh, 25 seconds. Uh, should, I should be able to get there within 25 seconds, hopefully. So now if I press play, uh, what engine are you using? I'm using Unity, Luke. I... I can use Blender as well to make a game, but I prefer Unity just because of uh, just simplicity. You like all the programming Yeah. I just like oh no, but you can do all that programming shit in Unity or in a uh, Blender with Python. Yeah, but we don't. Hmm. You might for now. Python's a bitch and a half. Okay, so now we're in this. And now, I, if I run over to this cube and hit it. Hey Jordan, sorry I've been gone so long. School has been a bitch. No bother, no bother, man. I have been missing from YouTube as well. So it is all good. So if I run over here, I shouldn't take damage. So as you can see, I don't take any damage. My health is currently at 100. And then when this timer has... has there we go. I'm starting to take damage because the timer has went past 25 seconds. So now when I go constantly into it, I will eventually die. So this is me getting hit every time by an enemy. And then, bloop, dead. It just comes up. Um, display 1, no cameras rendered. I will have it that when you die, spawn in a secondary camera that goes to your current teammate's position so you can watch them and... Uh, kind of be like, oh shit, just got behind you, watch out, watch out. And you can you can help them through that. Are you ever going to come to America? Eddie, probably not. Like, out of everywhere in the world I want to go, the first place would probably be Japan. If not Spain again. Because I used to go to Spain like every fucking, like, two or three months. I've learned to code in Python and uh, VB. I don't know what VB is. But, uh, but I've done stuff with uh, the Source Engine too. Uh, Python, I find, is a bitch. Have you ever have you used Java or C Sharp, Luke? Also, what's your picture of? Is that of the, of the girl that I think it is? I think it is. It's a. No, no, it's it's worse. It's like a picture of like a Down syndrome kid. No, but it's like a meme. It's like it's it's something absolutely stupid, and then it's just her face. No, but we've done it one time, but I, I, I want to say the girl's name, but you know, or, don't say, yeah, so we done one with her. <laughs> what? I, I know. I'm not even walking, fuck. Me, just... Why not USA? USA is badass. It's all good. The only problem with that is, Eddie, like, if I had the money, I would go. It's just right now, like, I honestly don't. Okay, so as you can see, like we don't take any damage walking into it. And then once the timer has been set, we do. So like I could have kind of like a um, maybe like a timer randomly in the sky that says when it is eight when people are able to start fighting. Maybe I don't know. Um, so um, let me just wrap my brain around this for two seconds. Um. Okay, so let me go level. Uh, let me go um, new uh, UI text. Let me go instead of this being. Let me be world space. Where is this canvas? This canvas is over here. I don't want it to be there. I want it to be over here. So we can see it in the world. Uh, rotate it. Nope. Move it. Uh, rotate it. Um, okay, it's not letting me pick a defined. Okay, here it is. My bad. So uh, ninety. Now we move it over here. Move it back. Move it here. There we go. And now we go text. We want to make this like fucking. What's that? What is that? What is that? What is that? Four eighty. Four hundred and eighty. 
by 90 might have to be a lot bigger so uh, this is just going to be zero for the time being and this is also going to be called num just num or time uh, it's an old meme i forgot to change but python is a bitch especially when uh, i was learning it at 14 in school see that's the thing we never got to learn shit like that in school we just kind of we're like thrown in a room and we're like, this is a mouse, this is a keyboard. And then like, that was pretty much it. Like anything outside that, like when it comes, obviously like I do know like RAM and all that. But it wasn't because my school told me, it was because of, uh, what's it called? Uh, college. Okay. So... I have a script where this would actually work perfect so I'm actually gonna go and get that now um, okay so let me go here um, uh, survival spirits power up testing assets um, it's just called timer so is there one here nope um, Power up testing scripts timer here we go so this script right here would work perfect for it and well not work perfect for it but I'd be able to get what I need from it to make the script that I'm currently making work also I keep on forgetting that my uh, face cam isn't on and I keep on doing gestures and whatnot so I'll turn that back on now in one second sorry about that guys I honestly for I honestly thought I returned it back on there a few minutes ago so let me get this timer script open it up please do not fucking crash on me and what do you know this bitch fucking crashed again she got me dancing um i'm pissed my middle school doesn't do photoshop classes but yet all the other middle school do maybe uh, really do not be upset bryson like i'm not joking photoshop is not the best I, my whole college was, uh, uh, the college course I done for game design was teaching how to do Photoshop. I didn't understand one class of it because I learned GIMP. GIMP is a free program you can get online and you do not have to, uh, like if there's something that Photoshop can do, GIMP can do it for free without needing to buy anything. And if there's something it can't, you can get a plugin online put it into the program and boom like you're just you're fucking sorted you literally just go into the to its plugins drag it in and then it can do it i don't know why this isn't opening up in um the existing mono develop this is a uh, really confusing okay let me just close this one then close you also if you guys are enjoying this please give it a thumbs up um hello damage Okay, finally. So this is what I have. So I have timer is UI. Also, this is in Java, so this really fucking helps me. So um, ver timer UI dot text. I just made that text field there. This is the time. The control is the uh, cancel. The control is the player in this instance. Um, so in here we go uh, reset time. So we can uh, just copy copy this whole function, drop it in here. Uh, obviously, there is a few things we are gonna have to change. Um, in here we go time plus time dot delta time, and then timer is equal to time dot string. So again, uh, copy. You know what? Copy all of this. Wait, is this in function update? Yeah, this is in function update. So just copy this, uh, go back in here. Is there a function update in this? There is not. Okay. So uh, function update. I know, could I just um, copy the, the other part out? But fuck it. So timer.txt, which is this, is equal to time, which is this, to string. And then in. Uh, we can then do. If time is greater than um, 
set damage. So now we literally just go up here, get an int, go over here, pay, paste, make that set damage, copy, make that to, um, make that to 900 or whatever. Then, um, we literally just send off the, um, we then send off, okay, so this doesn't go off in this, this isn't in here, and we literally just do this script then in here. There we go. So if time is greater than set damage, which is going to be 900 and time is going to be zero, uh, do, the, do the timer script, which is constantly getting updated in this, and then that will find the player. Yep, that seems all schnifty to me. I was going to record a video, but my OBS wouldn't show my face cam, and I was saying it, it didn't show the webcam. I was so confused. Hi, Neef. To get your webcam to work, go into... Um, here's my OBS right here, so I can actually show you in the stream. Go click... Um, what is that? Right mouse button, add video capture device, and then your webcam will just show up if you have not done that already. So, um, game manager. Face cam, my bad Eddie, my bad. So, okay, we have a, uh, a load timer already has a definition of timer. Uh, what? What do you mean, already has a definition of timer? Where is that error? My, uh, allow damage, line 14, line 14, function timer. Oh, timer is text, okay. It's so time with a capital, Shit. <laughs> time with a capital shit. Um time timer on and then we just put timer on timer on here. So that was that was my fault, sorry about that. Okay, so time is going to be zero. We want set damage to be, what, 25? Uh, we'll set it to 100, just, just for now. We're also going to go and get the num right here and drag that into here. We will, this isn't, okay, so where is this at its current moment? It is very fucking small, as you can see, it's right here. We will make this, uh, it's 14, so 14 by 3 is uh, 42. So 42, well, that's a little bit more seeable, I guess. Um, I've already, I've already did it work before, so it's the same. It's not working now. Oh, okay. Um, sometimes OBS will work. Try plug out your plug, uh, webcam and plug it back in. I know you've probably got a million videos where people are saying that to you, but just try doing that. Um, so in this, where is it? Timer is equal to time to string. And then in this, see, it's, do, it's trying to do reset time. Reset time does not exist. So, oh wait, reset time is here. So reset time, if time is greater than that, do timer on which is you but if time time is e is plus but the fuck it but the but the and then timer is e with the but the but the okay so <laughs> okay everything should be working right now but when i press play how come it ain't so when i press Okay, I think actually the reason it isn't working is because there's no player in the scene. So it can't do the rest of the script without having a player. So just for the time being, I'm just going to drag you into it. And then uh, if I give it two or three seconds. Okay, if I make this, uh, say, 10. Or uh, 10. Then go out of it back in. There, it's 10. So this isn't... The uh, timer is not updating. So time plus 
equals to time dot delta time. So let me just save that. Let me quit out of it. And let me try it again. So let me go lobby. I don't know if we're going to be able to see this or not in the game. But we will, we will see. Okay. Okay, so we can see right over there that it is a big floating zero. Which is good, because we want that to show us how much time until the game, until damage is um, starting. So... I don't know why this isn't working. Is time time up here is a float, so maybe here it has to be a float. So uh, float, save. Maybe that might be the only difference because you can't add a float to an int. Face cam still off. We need your beautiful flan face. Okay. My beautiful flan face. My my beautiful flan face face. Ah, I dropped my bottle cap. So again, thank you guys very much for the thumbs ups. So right here you can see that it is zero. So we press play, press play, the shit is gonna go off. Boom, we have it working. We have it working. But we need it to go reverse. So we need it to count down from 1500 Two zero. So set damage needs to be minus nine hundred. So um, set timer. Um, this is I'm just gonna throw a minus in front of it. And um, low disk space. Yep, yeah, I have no memory on my computer. So time. Let's just do minus time minus time dot delta time. Wait. So, wait a minute. If we do. If we do this as. Wait. Okay, let me just. Save that. Sorry about this. I want it to be. I might have done this backwards. Do your college, uh, do your college professors watch your vids? I hope not. Cause I'm a majority of the time I'm slagging there, slagging day bitch asses. No, all of them are pretty cool. I am. Um, we had to make a website there recently, and my website was just packed full of my YouTube videos. So it was like you had to, sh you had to like set up a dynamic link. And I was like, I don't know how to do that, but here's my YouTube video of me making my game 800 times. It's like one of them was me making, it was like the whole playlist of me making my uh, survival spirits. Then it was like two episodes of this, like eight months ago when I first started like a, like a kind of like a template version of this. And then it was like a video of my super hot game clone I was making. I was like, here's some video, here's some old videos, but it's like, it was, it, you had to have like six pages and like one was like about where to find us, previous game, uh, previous games I've made, uh, current games I'm making and all that. And I was like, yeah, well, I might as well just show this in, like it, it, it'll count as something. Okay, so if I do this, will it count backwards is the question. I don't know. I actually, I'm curious to see if this will uh, start counting backwards, or if the shit will just break. So I clicked play already. It's just frozen. So, um, we are um we are stuck on zero. So, um, I guess it doesn't work. Huh. So wait, if I do this as zero, and then if I press play, will it still count down or? Hmm, no it won't. 
Um, I could do that. Fuck. There's 60 sec... How many milliseconds are in a second? Milliseconds? I thought it was a thousand milliseconds in a second. It works in degrees. Like so it's so it's seconds, so it's sixty seconds. milliseconds. Well, then again, I don't know because twenty-four hours in a day. Mm, Can you look? Seconds. Yeah, how many milliseconds are in a second? Fuck! I forgot what I was doing. Oh, minstrel. Yeah, I can <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm okay. So time that uh, one thousand maybe. One thousand? Yeah. What's one thousand divided by sixty? What's one thousand divided by sixty? Shouldn't it be sixty divided by thousand? Don't confuse me. <laughs> just, just do a thousand divided by sixty. A thousand divided by sixty is like point zero six. Yeah. Point zero zero six I mean. Um No. <laughs> mm -hmm. Don't tell me the answer. 1,000 divided by 60, that is 1... And then, no, no, it's gonna, it's gonna be, it's, it's 1.6 something. Yeah, I know. Or 0 0.16. Yeah, I know. 0 0.16 something. 0.16? Where the fuck did you get the 1? Give me a sec, then. 1,000 divided by 60. 60 divided, 60 by 10 is 1. I was right. What? 0 0.06. Just 0 0.06. It's 1,092 is take two zeros off or three. You move it back three decimal places. They're the only thing 0 you can do. 0.06. You sure about that? Yeah. I have it right here, remember? So. Every what part of Ireland do you live in? I live in Wicklow. Hey, so, I? so every second. Mm -hmm. That doesn't make sense. Okay, do do it the other way then. While well, you were saying it, sixty by a thousand or whatever it was. Because no way. That adds up in my brain. Well, what you've every. Every frame is 60 frames, so 60 by a thousand shouldn't be 0 0.06. You said divide it. Yeah. 60,000. No, not, no, not 60. A frame mm -hmm. is 60 frames, but I want to know... A frame is 60 frame. seconds. No, not one frame, no. One one second is sixty frames. Okay, you said one frame is sixty Sorry, frames. Sorry, one me. one frame. No, sixty. One second is sixty frames. One second is sixty frames. So, so you're trying to find out how many milliseconds are in a frame, or in a second. Yeah, you said a thousand. No, you multiply. No, you said a thousand. Yeah, yeah. That's so in one so how many? So to find sixty seconds. No, no, I just want to know one, I just want to know one second's worth of frames in milliseconds. My brain adds this up. One second is equal to 60 frames, mm. yeah? Yeah, but how many milliseconds? One second is also equal to a thousand D milliseconds, yeah, so which means 60 frames is equal to a thousand milliseconds. Yeah. So de- oh, I almost said so download. So divide a no, thousand. You don't need to divide anything. I do! Do you get this fucking shit? Divide 60 by a thousand. Why? Just download. De Why do we keep going to say download? I already did. Zero point zero six. Mm-hmm. Mm. You can't be what it is. Okay, let me let me look this up. Being silly. No, okay. Zero point zero six. Multiplied by. Why are you multiplying? 
Cause, Cause you said this. So you said okay, that gives you sixty. Yeah. But that's not in milliseconds. I want this in frames. So one thousand divided by point zero six, which is gonna give me the same thing. No, see, it was right. One point one one six. I, I knew I was fucking right. Fuck you. One point six. I told you it was that. You're confusing me that we're fucking saying it. 1.6. I don't have it in front of me. You do. I don't. What the fuck? I don't. Neve, I'm doing this in my head. I just had to do that there. 1.67. Yeah, so one point. So one. One point six. Okay. You know, like you said, one point six. Yeah. I bet you you're saying it as one pound fish. I think. One point six. Damn right next to the ocean. Damn right next to the ocean. What? Oh yeah, Wicklow. Yeah, right next to the ocean. Yeah, it's actually pretty. It's actually pretty slick. Me and Eve used to go to the beach every day. Yeah, we're pretty. Until something happens. Until Neve got fat. <laughs> happens when. That's what happens when all the weed is big. Shit, I just closed it. Okay. So now we need to look up time dot delta time backwards. So unity time dot delta I'm not even fucking typing. Unity time dot delta delta time backwards. There we go. So how to make it go reverse. Delta time going backwards. How do I do that? Oh shit, this, only, this post was only done like six months ago. Okay. My script has been working fine until I moved computers and now it's saved. I'm sure it's funny. I have two cars, both traveling left. Okay, I'm not bothered reading that. Um, time dot delta time. Can I not just do minus? Time dot delta time. Can you look this up for me as well? Because I really need I really need to be bear back. All right. How to make? I have it. Ha, I want to have a timer. But I don't want to have the timer. Count up. I want it to count down from an existing number down. Wait, I'm a fucking idiot. Timer minus equals. Oh, sure. to do <laughs> that hurt my neck. Um. Time minus that timer dot that. So why the fuck isn't this bitch working? I really need to pee. Really, really need to pee. I really need to pee. I really need to pee. Really need to pee. Oh shit! What the fuck error is this? What? Look, I can play my game with these ugly ass errors. What the fuck is that? Never seen them before in my life. Oh. I never. What? Okay, timer 900. And now, hopefully, we'll just start going backwards. That's all I wanted to do. Okay, set damage, I don't need at this, at this moment. So, when timer is less or equals to zero dot. And also, if time is greater than or e or equals to zero time equals zero boom that's all I need <sighs> okay so um so every frame take one point six away from the flow See, that's every frame. 
See, I could just do this and go, um... Uh, where did I put this? Where did I put this? It's apply dam... Okay, I'm gonna have to open up that other script, which is probably gonna crash it. So... Um, apply damage... Um, no, not apply damage. What was it fucking called? <laughs> um... Allow damage, was that not what? No. I was literally just fucking doing it. It was the invoke repeating. Oh, hunger. Um, player's health. Uh, player's health, player's health. No, it's not there, okay. And God for my scoliosis ass brain. Slowly but surely it'll fucking remember it. Come on, just don't crash on me. If it crashes, I'm going bad room. Okay, it didn't, fuck's sake, the one time I actually wanted it to. Um, okay, so invoke repeating, this is what I need to get. So copy you, bring this in here to this, and paste. So, I literally just copy, um, I need to make a new function, so function, function, uh, reduce time, and then, uh, and literally, all that mathematics, I don't, goes literally out the window, because of, I can just do it this way. So, time equal, no, time is, uh, let's equal to 1. And now I just literally go reduce time, copy, bring this up here, go paste, and uh, get rid of the F, get rid of the F, make this uh, 1, and make this also 1. Um, actually, I think I can just do that. Re re redo this every 1 second, maybe? I don't know. Um, I uh, And then once this is on, timer is on, which then sends the script, which is damage on. So, let's see if that fixes it. And I fucking ticked you to say you were done, you little fuck. Give me more fucking problems than health benefits. The best over... I fucking hate these. Failed to cluster... Fu what the shit? Fuck off me. Um, string to float, float to float is not compatible with string dot float into... What? Okay, so maybe I need to do this again. And wait, can I just and say maybe that will counteract it? I saw my camera was glitched there for a split second. So maybe this will counteract it. They uh, the one before that with the clustering save, I think that was just telling me that um my level was not saved. So uh do 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 there we go, that fixed it. These can literally just, uh, I think we can continue playing the game with it, even with these, with these here. So, I hope, so let me press play. Okay, so we need to go here. Time is 900. What is this? Okay, now they're gone. Okay, what what the fu- what is it? I'm not even playing the game, I'm getting these errors. Failed writing cluster file. What the fuck is that? I need to look that bitch up. I've never seen that before. Okay, Neve. You look up failed writing clustered file. What? Look up. Failed. Failed. Hey, doing zombie. I'm just running bathroom. I'll be back in two seconds. Failed. Failed writing clustered file.
like mad and bacon. Okay, so there's nothing I have to worry about. Oh fuck. Oh, okay. Okay, so my so my script is working then. Okay. So I have if time is equal to zero. I don't know what if time is greater than no. If time Okay, so let me let me try this. Maybe I done the wrong alligator. Flan, how big is your room? Oh it's fucking Eh. It's big, but I've so much shit that it is literally cluster fucked. Like it, there's nothing in it. Literally, the script that just came up, the the clustered file fucked. Like it, it's just gone. Like. Hmm. Okay. It is going down here, but it is not updating the text. So, um, why is the question? Save. Now let's see if it works. Thank you very much, zombie means a lot, buddy. If you wouldn't mind, could you please give the video a thumbs up? It would really mean a lot. I'm going to turn back on my face camera in one second. I love watching them every time you put them up. Thank you very much. Okay, so we have here... Okay, let's see if this works. Okay, it's going down as if it's working. But the text is not being updated. So, timer.text is equal to time to string. Maybe because it was a float it wouldn't work. So, we'll try it now. I just gave it a thumbs up. Thank you very much, man. Also, if there's anything you think I should add to this game, go right ahead. Um, this game is going to be... There's a link in the description. You can go and click now to get it. But I wouldn't until this video is completely done. So you guys get the newest version. Again. Okay, time is equal to zero now. Okay, let me make this like a 900. Why the fuck is this not working? Okay, so let me put this back to 900 and press play. I don't know why it isn't updating. So canvas, num. Okay, and now if I go to game manager, drag you into here. If I also go in here and make okay there, if I just do this, that should just work. So save. Uh, you ever hear the song Twisted Transistor? Nope. Neve, do you want to put that on for two seconds? What is it? Twisted Transistor. I think this thing right here, this error is fucking it up from not working. Like, oh, if I click... Transistor or transistor? Transistor. Oh, corn, I like corn. Okay, you can stop now. Just copyrights. 
Okay, the re I, I think the reason this isn't working is because, again, there is no player in this scene. So I'm going to throw in a player and see if that fixes it. So it's really annoying me what that whole cluster... I think yeah, it's annoying me that whole cluster bullshit. So let's see if this fixes it. So right now, okay, boom, it's working. The only thing that was stopping it was because of the uh, uh, the player wasn't in the scene. So right now we will, you'll see here, we will not be able to take any damage until that has reached zero. So uh, I've set it to fifteen minutes, which is a bit much to. To be but um you think it sounds good it sounds more like uh, what's it called the like uh what's the shit uh, fucking what's it the daughters of darkness thing kind of sounds like the daughters of darkness thing yeah from the like two three seconds i got from it So the problem was there, as always, I put the alligator the wrong fucking way. So when I play the game now, so like you can see here that um, uh, the timer is there. So that's just like a generic time that's in the sky. Everyone will be able to see that, and it's the exact same time. So when I walk up to this, now hopefully I shouldn't take any damage. My health, as you can see, is 100. So, boom. Didn't take any damage. So now let me go up here. Uh, set this to... Um, game Manager. Set this to... Uh, 10. Play the game. So, 9, 8, 7, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And now we should start taking damage. So... Boom, now we take damage. Boom. And yeah, so that perfectly works as well as I wanted it to. The only thing I want to change to it is where it will send a message to all players and not just me. I don't really know how to go about doing that at its current at this current time. I will have to do a bit of research on that. Plan five of my friends said they would subscribe soon. Uh, then they when they are done playing uh, when they're done playing outside nice thank you very much man okay so if there's anything you guys want me to add in real quick um hello what uh, I'll do this for another seven eight minutes just to round it off and then I'll end the video so um I could add maybe food so you can then pick up um did no Weber hasn't joined yet I could do timed weather so um weather would uh so it would start raining after a few seconds or mist would start happening only way or uh, the only way about doing that though is um is again I'd only be able to do it for single player and then down the line I'd be able to do it for multiplayer once I and when I mean multiplayer I don't actually mean like I'll have to go online and forget how to do code about multiplayer I literally mean to get it to work multiplayer, I just need to figure out how to send, uh, see right here, the send message. I need to figure out how to send that to all the players and not just me. I have up here, uh, send message to player. And then player is equal to find game object with player tag. To make it multiple, I just do game objects. So it finds every player. And then I do this and it finds all of them. Only problem is I don't know how to make this part send it to multiple. So... I'll, I just need to look, do a little bit of more research on how to get that to work, and then, boom, we have a working, kind of, a timer where you can run around, gather as many resources as you can, and then, um, once that timer's done, you have to start fighting each other. So it's pretty good. 
I could do... I could do a little, a very shitty armor system, if you guys want me to do do that real quick, um, where you can uh, upgrade your own armor, or upgrade you your uh, your speed. Flan, one, one of them just subscribed. Thank you very much. The thing should appear on the screen, because I have the Pikachu on right now. So it should... Fuck, I just close out. It should pop up, hopefully. Um, so I could I could make it where your character increases its speed, um, you increase your jump, um, actually no maybe not jump, you can increase your, your overall speed, your, um, increase your speed, increase your, um, your damage so you don't take 10 damage you take just say eight and then after that you take six then five or six then four then I'll probably keep it at four cuz then you would have to get hit what 25 times to die instead of the original 10 so that, that seems that seems uh, easily doable so here I'll add in a new um, wood metal. Okay, we'll just use metal. Thank you very much for your thumbs up. I'll just use metal to increase your inventory because metal is going to be like the least of the uh, materials in the game to find. Uh, I, I could add claw, I guess, but for the time being, we'll just use metal. So, um, um,. So player's health, we can add now a new void. And this will be increase or er, yeah. Increase increase damage uh withhold, withstand, withstand. Withstand. It's stand. There we go. Um, and he gave this video a thumbs up, my friend. Oh, okay, nice. Um, okay, so we'd literally just do this, and then we would do um, what's it? Current obtainable damage. So current obtainable damage, which I think is currently set to ten. So current uh, obtainable damage is then equals or less to than ten. And to do that, we would literally uh, just go to our inventory over here. Also, we can close this because that's just taking up inventory space. Um, we would make a, a, a command. So just command here. And uh, this would be a command increase armor. Increase, increase armor. Armor, god damn it. A M or O U R. Why does that fucking not work? A M or O U R. There we go. Spell armor. <laughs> A R M O. -R. Okay, I've actually done it wrong. A R M O U R, yeah. The. Yeah. Um, how you doing, Jacob? Welcome to the stream, buddy. Hope you're having a good day. Sorry for cutting you off. Yeah, it's, for some reason my brain just fucking blanked on it. Okay, so now I um, do game object dot send message. See, send message is coming up now. And then I do this and that. And then in here I do the double bitches. The double bitches. Then in here I go back here. It's because it's easier. And then I grab increase armor. And I go in here, and boom. But now I do if um, metal if metal is greater than uh, armor. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go and make this real quick. So uh, this is gonna be um, an int. So let me just copy this and go paste and shit. 
Uh, fuck. Here we go. And this is going to be armor cost, so... Uh, no! Oh, thank you, God. Arm... Oh, my fuck. I keep on doing that. Oh, <clears throat> Neve, oh my jeep, it's better. Armor cost. There we go. So now I scrolly poly back down here um, to wherever the fuck I made this. Um, increase armor. So now if metal is greater or equals to armor cost, dude. What the fuck? Do the next uh, function, and then because you've uh, used it, you don't want it to be the same. So armor cost then to increase uh, to go, uh, to do it again. You you need an additional twenty five on top of what it was existingly. So there we go. So that should work. Um. Flan, his name is pronounced like Hakobob? Hakobob? Flan, if you could meet any famous person, who would it be? Oh. Oh. Alive or dead. Yeah. Alive or dead. Well, Brian instantly thinks of two people and they're both dead. David Bowie? Did they? No! Really? Yeah. Yeah. David Bowie? Yeah, I got that one. And, uh, what's Heather. that? Uh, what's his name? Robbie Williams. Robin Williams, whatever his name is. Robin Williams, yes. Or Jim Carrey. Is that it? I don't know, but still, Jim Carrey's fucking beast. Oh, okay, this is a bitch of a question. Any person in the world. Ooh, mine would be Dashy 150%. Yes. No, I wouldn't. I wouldn't use it up on a YouTuber. Let me, let me think. Um, Sandra Bullock. Huh? Yeah, she's kind of like my idol since I was little. I love her. Miss Confuckiality? Yeah. No. I love her. She's so cool. Armor costs. Okay, so armor is going to cost 10 to increase. Then after that, it's going to be 35. Then after that, it's going to be uh, 35. 60. And after that, I think it's the last one. It's going to be 85. I will probably have to increase that. Maybe like 100 or something. I don't know. But um, we will also need to go in here. Uh, go here and go crafting. And then make a new button. So just duplicate it. Uh, find where this button is. I'm going to put this in the middle just for the time being. I'm going to have to uh, rename this. Um, to uh, armor, armor, up, grade, and I'm also gonna have to go in here and go this and go uh, uh leveling, I uh, know inventory, and wait, shit, is this in my inventory? If metal, if. Player's health increase that by that. Okay, so if metal is greater than armor cost, send message to that and then multiply. Yeah, okay. So I need to go in here. My bad. How much longer are you gonna stream? Probably for like another five minutes and then I'm ending it because it is fairly late. Um. So now I need to go into inventory online. Increase inventory. Increase uh, armor, not inventory. My bad. What are you doing over there? Okay. So the only way to see this is literally by going in here, going um, player, and then going to current uh, armor cost is 10. But we also need to go to um, current obtainable damage, which is still minus 10. So if we go inventory, 
buy this, we should... Uh, also, I haven't said it yet where it actually you lose it. But uh, this is still 10. Okay... Hmm, okay, it didn't work. So... If that is greater than... If... Okay, so... Da, 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 da. If metal is greater or equal to armor cost... Metal is equal to metal minus armor cost and then game object dot send message to itself because your uh, the five minutes will turn into 15 minutes just you wait I know and um, will then send it message to itself looking for increased damage withstand which is in the player's health and then that will uh, this should be a plus, and that should, um, let me go up here and save all, okay, save all is already done, and now we'll see if this works. Unexpected void in player's health line 56, number 1, so 56... Um, okay, that might be why it's not working. I don't know if I recently just added that or if I only pressed save now and it only detected that I've actually done it. So that also might be why the script wasn't working because I didn't fucking save it. Okay, so now when we play the game and when we buy um, our armor upgrade it should come up saying uh, as you can see our metal is 100 or 1130 if we click this it should drop to 1120 it didn't drop at all which uh, is a bit of a fuck up somewhere in the script but um we will see if we lost um no it didn't okay so either it is not letting me click this and it's not working it is clicking it but this is not going down okay okay so void okay let me just remove these because maybe that might be why because of them uh, the gaps in it here so game object dot send message that and then armor cost is that okay so let me just go save all and try it again okay so uh, <coughs> the reason this might not be working is because um the um, armor cost might not have a value. Armor cost has 10. So let's make this minus 10. Um, and let's see if that works. If th that really should have made a difference. If uh, if it did, we would have saw the armor act or actually our metal go up by 10 and set it down by 10. So as you can see, it is not doing anything at the moment. Uh, and let's see if our armor class has actually gone up or down. So... Um, ch 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 player and armor class is still minus 10 which it shouldn't be okay so there's something here that I'm not doing right you fucking stupid you always fucking stupid that's a sign from Bubba Jibbles to, to stop the one work don't throw your laptop it's not bad I didn't go that far Play your DS. Do you want to play? The, the on your DS? Yeah. Why didn't you tell me? Indeed. My phone 
mom did. I don't know where the cord is. Why didn't you tell me your ass was dead? Leave. <laughs> you don't know I can just do this. And it does nothing. <laughs> Neve, when was this plugged out? What the fucking pancake? This one? I don't know either. <laughs> Fuck it if it isn't, it's broke now anyway. Okay. So, okay. Okay, let me look through this script. Um, both of these are on the player. So, I shouldn't... I shouldn't really need to send a message because they're on the same object. So... Earlier... Okay, what, what script was it? Was it this? It was this, wasn't it? It was just send message or something. Um, player dot send message. This, okay, this was in Java, not... But I send a message from Java to C Sharp. But this is going from C Sharp to C Sharp. Okay, what if I just get rid of game object and just kept it as send message? But then that would be... <clears throat> okay, I, alt I actually wanted to grab... Yes. <laughs> Trying to wake my bitch ass up. I'm falling asleep over here. Do I normally put CM? Oh, fuck it. Yeah, we'll see what happens now. If this, if, if this shit. Isn't done. I know. Okay. You want to let your your face? I got a YouTube notification saying your shit. Aww. Not really, but what what does it say? It says, did it did it did it. Did it. Somebody's live streaming. I fucking hate these new fucking stupid YouTube notifications. I get notified more by other people doing videos than I do by you guys. I don't even get notif notified anymore. Notified? <laughs> I don't even get notified anymore when you guys comment or anything. I just get notif notified when other people do. <laughs> I love how you would just say the right word, but you just keep saying the wrong word. Yeah, Stain is notified. Just like encumbered. Yeah. Over encumbered. No, it's cucumbered. It's cucumbered. Okay. <laughs> okay. So. Where is this? Okay. Increase armor. If metal is greater or equal to armor cost, do the following, which is. Armor or metal equals metal minus. Wait, is it meant to be minus? Wait, I can do this. This will probably. It's not gonna be much, but it just saves me the hassle. So metal minus equal or minus e equals metal cost. Then game object dot send message. Uh, increase damage with stand. And then armor cost. Up armor cost by 25. So next time you do it, it increases itself. But I don't know why this. This here is just. Hey! I swear to fish. My brain just thought of the easiest way to do it, but I don't know if it'll work multiplayer, and I'm not bothered going around the band trying to fix it in the future. <sighs> okay. I'm ending this in like a minute. Fuck all this shit. See, how you know if it works is the metal should have gone down. 
I didn't mean to open up. Come on. Close. Okay. Fucking bolt. Okay, let me press play. I need to I, I need to click this. Okay, so now if I go up here, click player, it should say this has gone down, but it isn't for some fucking reason. <sighs> Command. Okay, give me give me bleh. Okay, come on, Tippy Fuck, where is it? Player. Here. Grab this, grab that, grab button. Inventory online increase armor. Is that what I've called it? Increase armor. So then if metal is greater than armor cost, which it is If this isn't working because of that fucking alligator. Remember, you need to do sometimes use a buffer. Alligator eats the bigger one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Fuck's sake. I love when you proper struggle for like two hours and I just go, Did you put it the right way? Of course. <laughs> you earlier, Neve, shut up. Why isn't it loading up my dead scene? Have you added it to the... Oh, oh that might be... <laughs> okay. Shit. Does it work? Yeah. <laughs> too well? Yeah, way too fucking well. Now when I get hit, I gain held. <laughs> you should do that when you get hit by ring. No, now when I get hit by an enemy, I gain held. No, no, I did. Uh, any, anyone left besides me? Nope, it's just you, Eddie. What I've done was... I keep looking at my laptop and it doesn't work for In inventory, I have accidentally gone into the function update. I actually really hate... Like, look, my script is 280 lines. Mm -hmm. It is way too hard for me to find that one fucking line that has this bitch on it. Like, Search it. I know, but it's just a, bo a butter. There it is. Spend like three hours searching through yeah, I actually would. I actually would. So my medal was on 1130 if I remember correct. So I'm gonna go and play the game and reset it back to that. So come on, there we go. So all of that was because of my fucking alligator was backwards. So <laughs> let me go here. Um Player, my uh, metal is 105, so let me make that 1130. There we go. Uh, play the game. So now it's back to 1000 and 1130. So now if I click this, it should go from 1130 to 1120. So it should just lose 10. Nope, it gained 10. Okay, but did I lose health? Or did I gain um, armor? Let me check. Um, yes, I gained armor, but I gained. Um, I gained metal. So, I have. I didn't set. Right. Okay. Armor cost. I've set to negative. What? Wait. What? So. Wait. Wood. Wood. So, oh, okay. Hey, don't schmack. What is the crack, buddy? The reason it is not working is because I have it taking negative 10 from negative. So, two negatives is making it a plus. So, now if I go here, play the game, and I click uh, armor upgrade, it should drop it by 10. There we go. I click it again, it should drop it by 35. There we go. I drop it from here, it should drop it by 55. Wait, no, by 60, yeah, my bad. And then 60, it should drop it by 85. So it should be... ...940-ish? 950, there we go. 
But now I am literally fucking like indestructible. So, um, so like I only take minus two damage every time I get hit. So let me just do that again. Show you guys. So, um, let me, let me actually just show you this in the game. So game manager, um, here we go. Make this, uh, 40 just so I can actually have enough time to show you so if I run over to this rock as you can see we have 25 seconds until I start taking damage so let me run over here let me run let me run let me run as you can see my health does not go down in any way my health stays at a hundred so we'll just give that them few seconds while that is doing that I'm actually just gonna um, go into my player click this and turn off the rain it's annoying me a little bit I'll I'll turn it back on later so again as you see I walk into it I don't lose any health but now when I do I start taking damage I lost 20 damage there so now if I actually go in and I upgrade my armor I walk into it, I lose 8 instead of 10. Walk into it again, I lose 6 instead of 10, or instead of 8. Walk into it again, I lose 4 instead of, um, I lose 4 instead of 6. I walk into it again, I lose 2 instead of 4. I walk into it again, and I am pretty much indestructible. I do not take any damage. I click it again. And I actually break the game and I started gaining health back from people hitting me. Which is um, a pretty broken thing in my game. I could keep it that way and I could keep it where you're pretty much like a god. You just you gain health from their damage. But um, I'm going to go and fix that real quick. Um, so I can do it where... Um, um, if um, metal no if um, armor cost is a greater than or equal to okay this is where I need to add up so 10 25 35 25 60 so that's 6 and then 60 on top of, or 25 on top of 60 is 85. So 85, if it is bigger, then if, wait, yeah, yeah, okay, wait, wait, this needs to go the other way. So if 85 is bigger or equals to armor class, actually I need to make this 84. So if this is bigger than it, do the next function. But if it isn't, don't let it. So that pretty much means um, I'm gonna go fly and see you, man. See you later, Eddie. I'm just about to end this anyway. I'm actually about to put up. Um, oh crap! I stubbed my toe. Uh, doesn't matter. I'm gaining health. <laughs> exactly. Um, Snack and Eddie, if you're still here, Eddie, you can go and download this game in like 20 minutes. I'm gonna go and update it. So you guys can get the newer version and test it online against each other. If you want, you just can um, uh, like co leave comments in this video what your server is called that you're making. And you guys can uh, go and uh, play with each other just to kind of see if the game works. I'm actually going to just turn off the rain again. I'm going to permanently leave that off in a minute just because it is, uh, it's a little bit annoying when I'm trying to test it. I'm also going to make this uh, just 10. Actually, you know what? Let's make it uh, 5. And let's see if this works. Okay, so 5, 3, 2, 1. And now I start taking damage from it. I took 20 damage from that. So now if I upgrade my armor. There we go. Let me upgrade it again. Uh, again. And I think I should be able to do it one more time. Okay, I can't. So it is default stuck to where the most damage I can now take is uh, 4. 
so four is the most damage I can take, which is perfect. That is exactly what I wanted it to be. So now we've um, implemented a armor system into our game. So um, that wasn't one of my goals, but um, it's added, so screw it. So now each player can do their own um, their own amount of damage to each other, dependent upon how much uh, materials they have. So let me just go in here and uh, increase my metal back to a thousand, just so uh, it's roughly back on what it was. And I want this to add a zero on the end, add a zero on the end of this, and I'm gonna add a zero on the end of the next one, because I don't want it to be fairly simplistic, I want it actually to be a lot. Flan server, Flan made servers in this game. Yeah, this is a multiplayer game, you can you can play online against people. This is gonna be like a forest type game, but it's you versus the other person. The first person to die loses, or the Per the first person to kill the other person wins and um, for the time being it's only going to be one versus one but right now at this current moment there isn't going to be you're not going to be able to damage each other because this timer right here is set to 15 minutes and I haven't given it away I've only made it for single player to take damage, I haven't set it up to for multiplayer to take damage. Oh. <coughs> also, I was actually meant to go here and make this um, 100. Okay, so now uh, let me go and test it. So now this should eat into my metal. So as you can see, my metal is a, is a thousand. So I click it. I see, it only took 10. Hmm. Why is that? Why is that? Oh. My bad. Uh, this was meant to be here. So now let me play the game. Um, I'll wait till you finish and I'll find any bugs and let you know. Thank you very much. Like this, this is gonna work perfectly fine for single player, as far as I'm aware. But for multiplayer is where the problems are gonna come in. So uh, there's a few problems I know I'm aware of, and I'm happy that they're in it because I'm setting it up that way. Hey, doing welcome toast. Flan, I'm proud. Thank you very much. So we have a thousand. So now you click here. You have nine hundred. Your health, your um, damage is increased, and so now you only take eight. You click it again. You have five hundred fifty. Uh, now you only take six. You click it again, and I actually can't because I don't think I have sufficient metal. So um, let me make my metal a thousand again. As you can see, it, it it's gonna take you a lot of metal, and boom. Now I can only take four damage, and that is the most you can't do any more because any more and you will just break the game. Um, I'm gonna show you guys just uh, one or two things in the game just for um, um, uh, smack because just to show smack what I have so far. Um, don't mind the level and all this. This right here is broken at the moment. I need to fix it. So right now you can build a base. So you just place down a floor. Uh, place down another one just make sure like as you can see here there's the gap make sure they kind of snap together so you're not getting any um any image breaking so the image as you can see like the images fix up perfectly except for like a little bit of color the, the difference the reason that is because the sun is hitting one slightly different than the other but the materials should line up perfectly it's the way I make them see the way the lines here are line it up perfectly even when you go from one piece to the other you don't even notice so all that looks like it's going to be good thank you very much the reason I hope it turns out good is because this isn't for college this is just me making this in my spare time so this is just 100% anytime I'm in the mood to add anything to it I will I'll add stuff and see how it goes so none of this is going to get, okay, as you can see right there, I've already messed it up because I didn't fully check if things were uh, clipping together. Uh, the way to check is by looking at your minimap at the top. See, 
things didn't clip together, this piece of wood went into it a little bit. And as you can see, the image kind of freezes. I want to fix that because just in case that does happen and you need to uh, clip your pieces together, you can just kind of see it's not going to kind of go together because there's not enough of a gap in between here. There might be though if I look, look at it from the other side. Yeah, there is. Okay. So, come on. There we go. But now, as you can see, you're just going to get a load of um, flickery bullshit. Um, Flan, I'm going to be honest. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, and now at a wall. Fuck, I ended up picking base again. Or, didn't I? No, pick wall. There we go. So you go over here. Let's keep the walls going. This is better than your college work. Oh, no, yeah. <laughs> Fuck my college work. The reason I, I made this game for college. but Well, not this game. I made a, a previous version of it, like a really bad version. But I couldn't hand it up because it had to be for a phone. And phones wouldn't be able to handle this type of game. So I had to kind of scrap it and throw it away. But then when I was asking you guys what type of game you wanted, you guys were like, oh, we want kind of like a, a horror survival game. And I was instantly like, okay, maybe I can do like an island survival game. Just take away the horror aspect, but it's you and your, your mates kind of killing people. And one or two people were like, yeah, that, that, that would work. So it's kind of where I went with from there. Um, if there's a, if you, if you need to learn the controls, there's a, a page on the download link that gives you like a brief explanation on how to use them uh, just like if if something like this happens and you want to place it on the other side just press or and it'll rotate it for you and um, the wood isn't 100% uh, like clipping because like as you'll see there's a small little gap because the wood isn't long enough yet but like when you're adding it in the middle like it's perfect but when you're adding it in uh, to connect to a wall like this piece right here will be fine but you will see the uh, uh, you'll see here that like it's perfect there's no gap in the wall but the first part there's a little one Th these bubbles are a little bit annoying me but also because this fit fit there's like a little part that's sticking out so like there is there is a little bit here and there I do need to fix when it comes to like scaling and and whatnot but like you literally just throw together a little shitty base uh, go in here pick hallway uh, throw in a little crappy hallway add in an underground base see this one this is my like most proudest thing this right here is only gonna show up for you like that's still counting down so this shows you how much time you have and the little minimap in the top shows you as well uh, not how much time but it shows you like uh, your base you're building so you just walk over to this boom press E and you're in an underground base where no one can get to you only you can see in your game no one else will it takes a, a click or two to get back out because the game is a uh, anytime you press E anytime you press E you enter it so it's constantly like if I hold the eel just kind of spam in and out it in and out of it uh, Flan can't you wait uh, can't you just make it so you press escape it comes up with a menu etc settings main menu controls etc I can I, I can in the future but right now um, that isn't the case like right now I have escape to come up your uh, like your crafting options that is literally like a a four second change all I need to do is make it I or E instead of uh, actually I can't make it E because E I have to enter your base and to do this if you have a uh, this is your axe this is or this is your hammer this is used to um, uh, oh no this is your axe this is used to see I, I haven't really decided this this right here is used to craft and this right here is used to chop down trees and also um, upgrade 
uh, your base. As you can see, I'm actually slowly dying, which I did not notice. I forgot I added a uh, health or a um, a hunger system earlier. So if you actually walk up to a base and or part you've constructed and press E on it, you then turn your base from wood to stone, which doubles its health and stops enemies. Uh, takes enemies. To oh shit! I entered my uh, underground base by mistake. Um, makes enemies take twice as long to break into it. You can do this with your floorboards. Okay, see here, that actually, um, wait, is that like a way to fix it? Does that fix it? Oh my god. I think I found a way how to fix it. How to fix the image fucking up. You just kinda, you just changed the, oh my god, I am stupid. But I fixed it. So, then you have a, uh, now you have a stone house instead of a, a wooden. The only thing is, like, your floorboard here at the bottom is going to stay, or not your floorboard, your uh, foundation is going to stay wooden for a time being until I just add in that uh, implementation where it changes. It's literally just me dragging in a script to it. Also, um, you can do this real quick. Uh, this is also used to cut down trees and to mine. So sorry about the uh, bubbles and shit on the screen. I will uh, get rid of that momentarily so let me just run over here real quick so uh, use I clicked out of the screen my bad okay there you go see you chop down a tree you can do this you have to hit it five times and then it disappears E is to pick up as E is to enter and E is to uh, invent is into that as E is to upgrade, pick up, and something else, I can't remember. But uh, you just click this a few times, breaks it, and it spawns out a load of rocks. You then pick it up, pick up all the rocks, and as you can see, it is updating it in the corner. So I might have to remove the ability that it actually saves your, uh, your inventory, because you don't want to go against a guy that has a billion... Um, materials right off the go so I'm just gonna uh, change one thing real quick so um, canvas um, uh, do I have like a mini map here or something um, I actually don't know where my mini map is is my mini map just on my player as an object mini map there it is right there um, let me make this image just a tad bigger um crafting no it's not crafting it's on my canvas but where the fuck is it raw image nope that's blood um mini map there we go and now let me make this a good bit bigger so you can actually see where you are and whatnot in on your screen. This also needs to go. Um, also needs to go uh, behind everything. So nope, that did not work. This needs to go behind everything. So will that? Yep, yeah, there we go. So if you end up pulling up your inventory, your your map is behind it. Um, I also now real quick. I'm just gonna write a script just for my inventory it's um not going to be anything too complex just um um let me just go um sorry about this for the people who are actually uh still watching i said i was going to end it a while back so let me just do um map with a, a capital m i don't know where my okay there we go i'm what the fuck? Why can't I type? I don't know why I was doing that. So now I just go to inventory. And now I go, um, if input dot get key get key down, Q 
key code Actually, you know what? I'm just going to leave it where your inventory or your map is always on. There's no point me uh, making it where you have to press the button to see your map. I'll just leave it on for the time being. If people want me to add it where I can turn it off and turn it on, I will. So now I'm actually going to um, just uh, let me click here. Let me click apply. Let me click apply again, my bad. Let me just make sure everything is uh, working there. So now you can see the map is is really big at the top corner. Might have to make it a little bit smaller, but you know what, yeah, I'll just make it a little, little tiny bit smaller. Um, canvas um, mini map. Where the fuck is it? Mini map right here. Make it a small little bit smaller. There we go. Drag it up to the very top and into the corner. There we go. And now apply. I'm now going to go and build the game, which is probably going to take a few minutes. So while it's doing that, I'm going to go and uh, start. Uh, uploading it to the uh, 2D fucking uh, website so the link is in the description if you guys want to go and get it just make sure you wait until the end of this video if you're watching this video and it's not a lot of shame the game is up now so you can get it if you've got this far congratulations so um save project So this may take a while. I haven't built it in a while, so this may take a while. Okay, so let me go to um, here. Let me go to my game. Manage Operation Anchorage, or Operation Anchorage, Operation Deadshot. Um, view game page. We have 13, uh, 13 views and I, I've only uh, This is like my first time showing it to you guys and I told you just not to get it um, Packages uh, Add package uh, Package name No, it, sh it shouldn't have done shouldn't have done it like this uh, View game releases um manage game it should have let me add like a new release packages uh add package manage my bad um new release there we go it is going to be 0 0.1.1 and um, this is still building, I think. So uh, I'll let that do that. While that is doing that, I'm also going to go to the devlog and write about what I've recently just added. So, um, update 0 0.1.1. I'm working on a food system now. I've also increased map size and detail it. Into an island.
Okay. So this is nearly done, so. Okay. Um, I've added a simple rain and water that hits players' faces. Uh, ocean around the island with a mist if. Okay, that is nearly done. Um, I'm trying to think what I've done. Um, added a hunger. Okay, let me just. I've added a. I've added rain. A food. A hunger. Um, hunger. Health. A time where you can't take damage. Okay, so my game is done. As you can see, it's opening. So, what I need to do now is just uh, copy this, and uh, yeah, that is all for now. Stay tuned for more to come. Now I uh, uh, publish this. So that's a new update. Now we'll just go into here, grab the copy of the game that I just made, and put it up. So, uh, tablet. I go here. I go operation here. Uh, it's gonna grab this and that. And now I literally just go uh, add to archive. And uh, make a rare out of it. So it's gonna take a minute or two. Okay, so that I'm. I think I have two. I don't think I have enough memory. Whoa! What the fuck? 15 meg, holy shit, okay. 
Need to clear out some memory. Okay, so um Don't even know what this is. What's this? I'm gonna keep it for the time being just in case it's important. Um OBS, I don't really need OBS on this, but I'm gonna keep it. This is like 400, no, there's 100 and something meg, I can delete you. I'll, I'll clean, I'll clear this up later. Now let me just do that again. My bad's alright, I guess. Um, here. Or no, um, feckin' here. Click you. How, how big is this now? Hundred and something meg. Holy shit! The game has really got a lot bigger. Uh, add archive and compress. Okay. So it's 60 meg. It was 20 something earlier. Fucking hell. Okay. So now I literally just go um, here. Go back to this. Click this. Uh, go here. Operation. Grab this. And boom. Media. Okay. So title uh, Island Design. Okay, let me uh, turn off caps lock. Island Design. Okay. So now I literally just go and get a uh, a screen grab of my island and just throw this up. I'm going to make it where people can actually see what the game is going to be like before they get it. Which I didn't do with my other game, which is uh, kind of like a a huge a huge fuck up on my part um so there not the biggest but or not the uh, greatest image but it's an image nonetheless. So I'm just literally just turning off this canvas. Just so it's not in the way of the uh, island. I just go here. Click this. And then... Um, Yeah, I can do a little bit better than that. So there, that, that looks pretty good. So now I just uh, save this off as island. Uh, save it off to my desktop. Go back to here. Choose file. Desktop. Island. Island. There we go. And I'm um, Polish. So, boom. Now people will see that. This is the current controls. Thank you very much for your thumbs up, whoever just gave to me. Uh, this is the current controls. This is the newest update that just came out with the things you can do. And this is what the island currently looks like.
obviously like you can see here that it's stone and the rest it, not really fully uh, mapped out yet but it will be soon so we just go here and we go it's uh, windows uh, windows 64 and uh, yeah that's it I know I'll publish. So now you guys can go and get it right now. The first build was like 20 meg, this one's 60 something, so you can clearly tell that I've added a lot of new shit to it. Um, um, so yeah, that is it as far as I can see. Uh, let me just go back into this and re-add back in on that um, that, can that canvas. Uh, let me go to my uh, lobby, save it. Save the scenes, save the project, and we will end the video there. So thank you guys very much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up. You can go and get the newest version in the description, as I just updated it there. Sorry my face cam wasn't on in most of this, I was just kind of just drinking alcohol and just kind of chillaxing, not really like doing like a face to face video but it's kind of a, a video for you guys tomorrow i might be doing gta 5 not 100 percent on what i'm what i'll be doing i might play more dishonored and just kind of bomb that out get that out of the way and then finish uh, horizon zero dawn and then we will see what happens after that so thank you guys for watching this video again if you did enjoy it please give it a thumbs up comment rate, subscribe and i'll see you guys in another video real fucking soon Bye. Bleh.